I tell people like, like Friday Night Lights, like like nothing like it. Like you know what I'm saying? Like Friday night, like it, purest form of football, right. almost. If like, you, hey, if you play Wednesday night in high school, boys didn't even think about you. Right. You was Thursday night, night. You like you play Thursday? Sorry. Like when I was a sophomore, whatever. Uh, so I had the senior, whatever. He was like, uh, he was like Sproles, like uh, um, uh, the girls don't like first downs. But, they want to see touchdowns. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I was like, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, you feel me? Sir. Touchdowns. Welcome to Trust Level Season 3. Big Season 3. Big Legacy Vibes. Big. Everything we do is big. Super like big. One of the biggest babies in Louisiana that ever be produced at like 10 pounds. <laughs> Big Legend. baby tank. Oh, he was a whole person. Ten Walking. pounds came out Whoa, that thing. Jesus, came out that thing like <gasps> shift. Hey, automatically, <laughs> automatically shift. Yeah, first step was forward. Second step was sideways. <laughs> we talking about played played so many years with the Chargers. Played played so many years with the Saints. Played some years with the Philadelphia Eagles. Fly Eagles fly type stuff. Fly Eagles fly. But we say he's had and he's had a phenomenal career. We talking about records that he's created. Nobody ever shakes. We talking about the way that nobody can really say they hit Darren Sproles. Nobody was able to really move like D Sproles. Just the shiftiness, just the attitude, the grind, the mentality, everything that sets Darren Sproles apart. I mean, he's got things in in Canton that you know mm. I've 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 only aspired to do. Uh. Whether it be cleats, jersey, stats, they there. Touchdown ball. Helmet. You know what I'm saying? Like, there's, there's everything he touched. Jock seemed Strauss. to go gold. You know what I'm saying? It's, he's got a golden touch, if you shall. But my dog, Darren Sproles, has blessed us on this podcast. I'm Cam Jordan, New Orleans Saints defensive end. I've only been with the New Orleans Saints. My dog, Mark Ingram, uh, has been with, you know, Houston. And I say been with because it wasn't for long. <laughs> it was a good time, not a long time. God bless. <laughs> and then he was over with the Ravens for two years. And I said, bro, come on back home. So my dog, who's been in the, year for, been in the league for 12 years, you know, Saints all-time leading rusher, NFL's active leading rusher mark ingram the second don't be confused with the first he was a wide receiver he was a slot guy but he had some moves the second is the running back <laughs> the running back y'all yes, mark ingram the I second and i just want to say deuce. this is trust levels and i can't wait because I've, I've like i said we had a 10 pound baby alert my man only weighs 12 pounds now so he came out <laughs> <40 seconds. laughs> but bro bro y'all understand it's a treat for me dog to have my og Man, my OG dog. You know how you had your OGs. You know Will Smith, right? Cedric Ellis, John Velma, JV. Like man, Roman Harper. But this was my side. OG right here, dog. This is my dude. Poured into me, taught me stuff that I still take me to this day. I asked my dog like, "What you see? You feel me? Like, yeah, this is a special one for me right now. This is my my OG triple. You feel man. me? Man. Had that dog Sprosy in this thing on the trust level season three. Number Big. four, three. Big. Big. Yeah. Man, I appreciate y'all for finally having me on, man. Uh, uh, man, it's been, what, season three? Yeah. It's season three, right? Yeah, it's only been like 25 episodes. I told Mark, <laughs> if I'm not on season three, oh. he got to see me. Oh. I'm like, hey. I'm like, Mark, like, dang, like what? It guess, no, guess no, no, what no. I said. It guess what, what I said. I got the perfect started. opportunity for you. <laughs> 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 we're we, we setting ourselves to be established. You know what I'm saying? We, we, we're hitting our compatriots, the guys that we that we we can just call, hey man, do this, you know, do this real quick. We want to step right before you get to a guy with Pro Bowls like you, you know, with Listen, shifts man. like you. He heems. But y'all know me, like, I, I don't do too many interviews now. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like for me to come on. It's special. Yeah, like I'm. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't worry, we don't take it for granted. It's why we had to wait till the third season. We needed to feel yeah. like we were respectable. Like, you know, <laughs> you know, like when you, when you go to the league and you be like, dang, that's that player you've always looked up to. You know what I'm saying? Like, you don't just talk to him the first game y'all play him. Like for me, J you know, Julius Peppers, I was like, yeah. okay. I'm not going. Like the first time we played, I think he was at like Chicago or the Packers at the time. I was like, a couple more years. Like once, like once I got like two Pro Bowls under me. Pep, what up, man? How you doing? Can't, you couldn't just go there blindside. No, you couldn't just that. be, you know what I'm saying? So that's what we did. We, we had to come to, we, we respect. Because you have not even a respectable career. You've had a legendary career. At every level. You understand me? At every level. Been pimping since been pimping since been pimping. Honestly, I can't name a Kansas player, but I know you. Like, I got one. Hey, I ain't know <laughs> nothing about football. K -State. I say football. Football, because we say basketball, then you. Barry Sanders. It, that's two yeah. for you. 
I said one. I did not know he went to Kansas. <laughs> well, Jeez. well, from yeah, Kansas. from yeah, okay. from Kansas. Were you really a ten pound baby? Baby, and the only reason I say ten pound <laughs> baby because this man, uh, our, our former strength coach Dan, he used to be like Sproth, Sproth, ten pound <laughs> baby. I mean, can you imagine? Just look at how, like that's how he got this way. And I was like, wait, man, I was you? ten pounds, two ounces. <laughs> 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 And the crazy thing is, man, my mom had me like natural. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mom was a beast. A beast. Like, you know what I'm saying? 10 Out pounds, two natural. ounces, like natural. Yeah. You you hit 10 pounds as a baby, like, that I'm not naming you, like, Darren. You got it. You got it. You got to be got something heavy. You know what huh. I'm saying? Big tank. You right. Know? Yeah. So something. when when did you get the name tank? Was it that day? Man, <laughs> for real. Like, uh, like my dad, like, um, he named me tank that day. <laughs> That day. As soon as I came out, whatever, uh, they said the pounds, you know what I'm saying? Like, he said he, he, he like, man, that's Tank right there. Yeah. Man. So, like, man, that name stuck. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, like my family and the people close to me. Call you Tank. They call me Tank. Mm. Like, they don't call me Darren. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, yeah. That's my lame. mama didn't even call me Darren. You know what I'm saying? So it's like, yeah. Okay. That's just your government. Right. That's just your government. I call you Sprozy. 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 You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, hey, the whole family. Hey, you know what it is. The family functions, they call them tank. tank. So you That's know what it is. That's your name. Yeah. Tank. 10 pounds. Right. That boy is a tank, too. That boy, that, ooh. But a tank ain't elusive like that. A tank just be chugga, chugga, chugga. Like, you <laughs> feel me? Like, do, do. Like, right, you right. Eat, 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 eat. That boy. But hey, start off with the mentality, though. Like, you, right. you can't be a, you can't be he a. He is a tank, though. You can't be an accountant named tank. You can't, you can't be a <laughs> nail tech named tank. Like you you can't be scary, name Tank. No, you, you know what I'm saying? Ain't no like, afraid of the dark. You yeah. got to hey, stomping through that thing. You right. can't be soft, name Tank. tank. You got to be a beast, <laughs> name Tank. You got to be a tank. You know, this Tank, you know you know my son. Tank hey, is a problem. My, my son's seven, but he like he looking for all action at all times. He's a man child. That's what you he want, got, he got three. He got three sisters, so you know what I'm saying? He got to be protected. He got to be protected. He, he here for that. This little dude is a man child. Just be. That's good, though. It is good, but he just needs a little bit of you know, love. You, you know, you know. Hey, I always say, you know, you you want to be the one who have to like pull your child back. Like, right. Hey, man, chill out. Chill Instead out. of like, hey, go, man, go. No, you don't have to tell I him to pull go. him back. He you, be like, I be like, bro. He be like, Dad, I was nervous. So, so you you beat him up because he was nervous. All right, man. All right, Tank like, don't talk, get nervous. Man. He like that. That's how he like. Hey, Uncle him. Mark. Uncle Mark. <laughs> like, hey, I knew my dog was real. Like three, four years old. My dog, my dog walked to Mark was like, your daughter like me. She, she did, said, he did. I he said, fam. I said, you can't just tell said, another- daughter like me. You can't tell a dad that, bro. Like, right. you know, like me. He said, well, and one time he came with me, he said, I want to fight you tomorrow. I said, why not right now? That boy said, like he thought about it like- Why not right now? <laughs> yeah, he like thought about it like, I didn't think about that. But like, right. that boy got that mentality. It's dope, like, yeah. So, so tank- so Basically You got tank. any sports yet? Yeah, basketball, bro. Basketball? Okay. Hey, basketball. We working on all footwork. It's basketball. Um, you know, wifey had him in T-ball, and I was like, please, Lord, no. But you know what? Yeah, we're going to put him in tennis next. Uh, he's done, you know, he's done soccer. You want to do? All, all active sports. All, you're right. Speaking of kids, you got some demons over there yourself on that track. Speed demons? Like, Man, we I see got speed between, demons. Between you and your wife, y'all right. done created some super monsters. Right, like them girls over there. Flying. I say, we, my, hey, I be checking like your social, kids, bro. Like, like, they be out there flying. They be floating. They love track. They, mm. You know what I'm saying? Like, they got some good genes, I guess. You know what I'm yeah. saying? So they, no, they, ain't no guessing. What you mean? Because guessing? they running right now. Well, they you know floating. what I'm saying? They really running. Right. But and they, Cali running too. Like, right. you know, if you running in Cali, like you can run anywhere. There's, I'll say, there's some meccas in Cali. Cali is one of them. What, 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 Texas. Cali, is Cali, Texas, and Florida. Florida. Right. Right. So yeah. And, and every now and again, we got Arizona. You know what I'm saying? We, you we, make, man, we make more triple jumpers. get out of here with that. We had a Michigan boy that came out to the... I told you that <laughs> right? who I ran against, but yeah. yeah we have some oddities. We got some outliers. Yeah, you yeah. know what I'm saying? We got, we got some like here and there. But you know, them, them in them trenches, if you running in Cali, if you running in Texas, if you running in, in Florida, you could run anywhere. Right. So they got their love from the parents. You know, wife, wife you was an athlete. You're athlete. an athlete. Did you, so you she ran off. track. She ran track at... She ran track at Long Beach Poly, and then she went to... Uh, oh, she a cat? Yeah, and then she went to um, UNLV. Okay. So she ran the four and the eight. You know what Ooh. I'm saying? So she, yeah. And hey, you started off track. I know you started. But track, yep. Track, soccer. When you was growing up, basketball, football. Yeah, yeah. everything. 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 I'm everything. telling you, this, man. Wrestling. Yeah, wrestling. That's why too. your little butt be 
<laughs> out there <laughs> in that <laughs> hey pass protection be hemming people up. <laughs> no, I mean yeah. people think they could uh you know blitz sprawls like no nah, you get your little butt hemmed up real quick messing hey, with sprawls. He look light. But, but he, he heavy, heavy though. though. <laughs> and strong too, boy. Hey, that's what I'm trying to tell. I be trying to tell folks. I've said, bro, one, you can't really put a hit on, on Sprozy. Like, he gonna shift out of there. But let's let's just talk about the younger days. You started off track. Or you, what, what was the first what first sport you started off at? The first that sport I remember? started off at was, uh, was soccer. Okay. Like, um, that was my first love, though. Like, tell you the truth. Pele, Pele. Yeah. Out in Kansas. Out in Kansas. Which so if I would no in the country nah. you got plenty of you know space, <laughs> you know nothing but I mean? space. Yeah, <laughs> no, nah, but um, but like that's my first love though. Like um, if I would have known how big it is, like yeah, yeah, how big it is, it's the world sport. If you would have gone international because MLS, I, really, I might would have no, no. If they got three designated players where they could pay whatever they want, but so, MLS, man, they getting like a three hundred and some. Million dollars, Messi, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Neymar, that's what I'm saying. You Ronaldo. have to go international, though, right? But MLS hey. is cool, like nationally wise, we're getting there, we're right. fighting to get there. But we usually catch the you know, the champion leagues like almost retired coming in, yeah. right? You know, the David Beckhams. <laughs> oh, you're at the end of your career, come on, play for LA Galaxy. They we got, got three, listen, they got three designated players where they'll pay whatever, right? But, but like, DC did have that. That was my first night. love, though. My first love was soccer. Um, uh, then I went to track. Um, what events did you love and what events were you in? I, I was in the 100 and 200. Like, okay. You know what I'm saying? And they made you put, run the four. Everybody run Made the four. me run the four. Like, yeah, you know if you're a 200 meter, You know how it is. If you're a 200 meter runner, you have to run the four to get your 200 stronger. Yeah. You know what I'm and saying? You never want to do it. You never want to do it. But it makes your 200 stronger. Right. Allegedly. Yeah. But, uh, no, it does. It's not the, a legend. Uh, it's a fact. But the thing is, the thing is like, they gave me an option. Like, you weren't one of the open four. Oh, you want to run the four by four? Yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? Four by four every time. Always. Give me that four by four. Yeah. That open is really different. It's, it's, what? It's, it's different. I'm, I mean, I'm not running different. that. No. I ain't running that. The four by four, you can get some competitive juices going. It's under the lights. It's the, you know, it's right. the last race of the meet. So you, you can get some like competitive juices going. That four by four, you staggered. Are you talking about that open four? That yeah, open four. Yeah, that open, open four, four, you staggered. You, you got staggered. They in there running though. <laughs> Hoofing. Running. Like, you, that, yeah, they running. When you watch when you watch somebody drop a 46 in the open four, you like, oh. I'm right. talking 45. I'm watching huh? the world championships, bro. They running 45, 44 right. in the prelims. Right. Like, my thing is, though, like, my thing is, I, I don't got no stride. You know what I'm saying? I, I got one speed. How can you go. have a stride when you know what I mean? Go. Like, but if you ain't 6'2, 6'3, ain't no stride. Yeah, you ain't no stride. Like, I'm, I'm, <laughs> but, all some, go. but some, sometimes, like, the smaller guys, like, they, they have high top end speed, but that's all, like, it takes them a little bit to get there. Your acceleration, though, is stupid. But See, it, 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 that, that's really what sets apart. You can have top end speed, but if you have acceleration, what does it matter? Yeah. You right. have to have acceleration and you have to have the strength to hold the top hold end it. speed. Yep. Like my like acceleration was different. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, like I, 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 out of there. But in a three, I can get the top speed in like two or three steps. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm going like, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. But, um, you say we used to watch you on, on and you knew this as a like, young cat. Hey, I knew it. Yeah. Biggest, biggest feet ever, just out here flying. Like, is that a size seventeen? Be not because all you see is pros knees and be not, be not rolling. Right, but um, uh, but yeah, but uh, soccer was my first love. But like um, um, so I was like eight. My dad was like, uh, hey, let's um, let's see about football. Like, you know what I'm saying? At eight, yeah, eight. Like, my mom was like, no, nah, like, football, like, no, nah, like, he too little for that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, no. <laughs> Man, like, uh, she let me play. Like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, then my first carry was, well, uh, my first carry was a toss. I went 80. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? Then when she seen that, she's just like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, like, you gonna play good. football, like, son. Yeah, Wait, like, eight, eight years old, Sprozy was out there. Tank was out there. He <laughs> hee. We should have named him Jet, old, baby. Right. We should have named him Jet. <laughs> <laughs> Tank Jet. So I was... At eight years old, whatever. Uh, that's when I first. Uh, when I first. This was tackle football. It was tackle football. I didn't play no flag. I didn't play none of that. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? I went straight to tackle. Feet wet. Dive in. Throw Let's that go. boy in the <laughs> deep you know end. He need to learn how to swim. Throw him in right. the pool, baby. <laughs> <laughs> Ever since that day. So at like eight, yeah. The, um, that's when I've been playing. Like, I think I stopped playing when I was like thirty. Uh, like thirty six. I think I was done. Ooh. Yeah. At 36. That's a, that's yeah, a, yeah, so that's eight 36. years old, you go 80 to the crib, you still 
All but running back. You still play all soccer. You still play run track. You still play basketball. Like still- it was a time. It was a time where I was playing football in the morning. Then at night, I go play soccer. Mm. Like, you know what I'm saying? Then How the winter you- time, in the winter time, I would play basketball, basketball in the morning. Right. Then I go play soccer at night. So how long did the, how long did you play soccer for? Like I stopped playing soccer when I was in sixth grade. Okay, yeah, yeah. that's when I had to choose. Young yeah. love, yeah. You, know you got to choose. Love. You got to yeah. choose because they got seasons. They got football season, basketball right. season, track. Soccer was like with year round. You know what I'm saying? They got yeah. indoor right. season, and then they got outdoor season. Yeah. So you know what I'm saying? So my dad was like, "Man, like you gonna get burnt out? You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like you got to choose one. Yeah. You can't. You can't. You can't juggle." Right now, though, if I get you a soccer ball. Right now, no, I can't. Yeah. Mm. Right now, I couldn't do it. Yeah. Mm. yeah. I might be able to give you yeah. a little something. Might, you can, get, you, you can get one, two, three, and then they right. go over there. Yeah, right. You know? But them boys be poop, poop, right. poop. Yeah, I, poop, I can't give you like 20, but we could play yeah. like 10. You play soccer too, didn't you? Yeah, we, yeah. we could play like 10s. Like, I give you about yeah. 10 tap. We used to play 21. Yeah. Like, I tell people, I tell people, like, with soccer, that's where you get your footwork from. Like, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like with soccer. Like Bro, I got all mine in it. Yeah. They, they take soccer. Soccer? Lessons. They yep. all of them. They, all three of them. They uh well, my three oldest, my two, I have two little ones, but the three oldest, they 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 in soccer lessons twice a week. Okay. They they played their first season. My my mom they 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 did well. They liked it. So I'm like, let me get y'all right. right. You know what I mean? Like my daughter, so I tried her out of soccer, whatever. She was so dang on fast, like. She could, yeah, like yeah. the ball wasn't like, wasn't keeping up speed, with her. yeah, like with her speed, like, you, baby, you got to dribble. It is what right. I'm trying you know to go. I'm <laughs> right. I'm trying to go. Daddy, I got one speed. <laughs> Touche. But yeah. <laughs> it's hard to teach them. That's when we put them in track yeah. and then, like, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Um, we try in tennis a little bit too. Like, you know what I'm saying? Got to. Tennis is yeah. difficult, man. Yeah. Tennis they like is, tennis though. Yeah. My yeah. mom do, my mom play tennis too, but tennis is difficult, man, because once it get to a certain point, like, you got to go all in on it. Like, you got to. You got to go all in on it. And it's, we're it's not travel. Sing- we're not here for the singular focused sport kid. Like I'm Exactly. Not- but oh tennis God. is one of those. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Back to Kansas, bro. Like, so you played football. When you, sixth grade, you stopped playing soccer. So you focused on football, track, and basketball. You played those in high school too? Well, I started off playing, um, when I got to high school, so I did football. And then I did basketball, like my first, like my, um, like my freshman year. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Uh, then I ran track. And, yeah, but like, uh, my dad was like, well, like tank, like man, like that basketball side, like you know what I'm saying. Like you can play it, but you yeah. know what I'm saying. Like, but like, what you really gonna? You ain't gonna go nowhere. Like, uh, dang, you didn't hit him with the Muggsy Bowls line. No, but but, but my dad but did like, me the same you know way, bro. Like my dad was like, my dad was like, man. You probably ain't gonna get over like five seven, five eight. Like you know what I'm saying. Like he was real with that. Yeah, like, you right. Know what I'm saying? He, he shot you a hundred straight up. Yeah. So I kind of dropped the basketball. You know what I'm saying. You started running indoor track or something. So, so I did uh, football. Um, I did indoor track and I did like outdoor track. track. Like you know what yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, outdoor track. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, that boy was. So in that's, track what I, what that, you, you that's what I did. That's what I did. Track year round. Yeah. Hey, that indoor. Boys be running the the, the four hundred. Be what eight laps in? Two laps. Two, two laps, laps. Two laps. Two hundred meters. But yeah, one lap's two hundred no, meters. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, right. Yeah, eight hundred. Yeah, yeah. Eight hundred. Oh, this yeah. is ridiculous. Like four hundred be two laps. Right. I'm here for the sixty though. I love that. I Lit. love. I love watching the sixty. That's all I wanted to run in college. Yeah. But my head coach uh wouldn't let you run. Nah, he wouldn't let me run. Like you know what I'm saying. Like he was just like he was like uh if I let you run like track like you're not gonna be ready for the spring like you know what I'm saying spring ball. Yeah. So I'm like man, I'm like dang. I was like, Cap, you should have been hand him your hat right there. That's all yeah. I wanted to run with the 60, though. Yeah, yeah. Right. I, I want my nothing. Let me else. work my speed, coach. Yeah, yeah let me work my speed. I'm here for the 60. I want, piece. I want the 60. There's no 100 in I'm indoor. Not, yeah. It's a 60. No, I'm saying like yeah. outdoor season. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. You don't want outdoor, outdoor season. No, he just wanted want 60. That. I said, not the 100. I want the 60. Not the... That's it. I want no 200. I want, just give me the 60. I was trying to get to the javelin in the indoor. The javelin. I was like, boy, that shit look like Not javelin, hammer throw. I hammer throw, yeah, yeah. They got the yeah, they got that. I said, oh, that's what that shit my, my dad did me the same way, Sprozy. I was about junior year. I'm like, I transferred. I'm like, man, I'm about to hoop, man. We got a good hoop team. He like, listen here, bro. How many letters you got? I said, I'm, I'm like that though. <laughs> I said, man, I'm like that though. I'm getting buckets. I'm dropping dimes. I'm D. I'm 
Nobody can push defense? you like your daddy. Nobody can irritate you like your daddy. He said, bro, Nobody man, you can look out for you while pissing you off. You like about to run this indoor track, bro. Running through the hallways of the school, all that. Yeah, you know all that. I mean? Yeah. 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 But yeah. Uh, nah. But the thing about your daddy, though, he going to keep it 100, though. You got know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. Well, you, could be fear, you could be fearful of I him mean, right? look, as well as like right, respect his, right. his words. I mean, all our pops. Need, though. All our pops, like, been there for us. I don't think, I know I wouldn't be who I am without right. my pops or where I'm at without my pops. Me. Every crucial decision I ever made in my life, it was my pops was there to help me make that decision. Yeah. So it's like, that's the thing, bro. Mm -hmm. Hey, all of us had some pops to help us out. Right. Kept it real with us. Yep. So he got you, he got you focused on, on football and track. So you get to high school and go crazy, go stupid. I'm just look. I just looked down and see these numbers. I said five thousand two hundred thirty yards, mm. seventy nine touchdowns, eight point four yards. I said, How long were you carry. in high school? <laughs> five thousand yards in four years. Whew, that boy was out there huffing. To see, but the thing is though, like in Kansas, like when I was there, like uh, you didn't go to high school until tenth grade. That's how they did it. Like, so you, you know have three years of these stats. Yeah. So like, excuse but me. But like now, like like now they got freshmen, yeah. To um, yeah, like, you know yeah. what I'm saying. But they had like a middle school, back, like six to eight, six to the eighth grade or six to ninth, ninth grade. Yep. And then, so you go go crazy in high school. Goes ballistic. Five thousand two hundred thirty yards. I just keep saying it because now that I know you did it in three years, like that's just ridiculous. So What's, I didn't like with me. I, I didn't start until my junior year though. Like I had a guy I like doing it in two years. What other positions you played though? It's just running back. You played receiver. Did like return, I played running back. You played defense. Like I played running back. Uh, then like my like my sophomore year, or whatever. Uh, they had me playing corner. But man, I ain't I ain't no corner. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Hand me that thing. Yeah. Let me work. Let me, let me, let me work. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? But um, uh, like my junior year, whatever. Uh, that's when he took me off of defense. You know what I'm saying? He's letting me just run the ball. I'm like, thank you, cause I man, yeah. all that tackling and doing. I don't want to do all that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm, here to, I'm here to break tackles, yeah, not make I'm tackles. Like, yeah, all that tackling and yeah. backpedaling yeah. for what? I, 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 I go I'm going the whole game. Ain't nobody touching me. <laughs> like, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> yeah, I'm ain't nobody touching me. Like, I really like, like, really play, play, uh, like two years. Kansas City yeah. Star Player of the Year, '99 and 2000. Yep, high school oh. All American, '99, 2000. Kansas Player of the Year by USA Today. <laughs> It ain't, we ain't talking like by the local newspaper. Man. We're talking about USA Today. Just to put this in perspective, when did Drew get to the league? Like 2001? He was, he was playing college. In, yeah. I think he got Drew to Brees the league. Drew Brees was in college at, in Purdue in the 90s. I know this for sure. No, he wasn't. 99? No. He started freshman year. I say he was in college. I don't he know, was. He, he, yeah, yeah. I, I think he yeah, was. That's what I'm saying. You're right. He, you're right. No, but. He was he was back to back the player of the year, too. He was supposed to be out there being player of the year. I in the league already. Back to back, though, mm. in high school. He said he ain't played till his damn junior year. And he, he didn't get the as soon as he job. got on there. Running back. But this is the thing, Deep. though. Uh like my junior year. My junior year, I got a starting job. Whatever. Mm -hmm. My third my first three games, I had three hundred some yards. Each, like my first three games. Each, no, just like each game or just each game. <laughs> like my first, second, and third game, hey, I had that's solid, solid. Each game. Oh, no. First, second, and third game, 300 yards. 300 yards. Like, you know what I'm saying? So you had 900 yards going into week four. Week four. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, the, but the thing was, like, what kept me going was, like, they kept on saying, like, I, I was too small, like, to play high school. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, right. what I was doing in, like, middle school, I wouldn't be able to do that in high school. Yeah. They hit you so I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? They always, they always try to yeah. look, they, look. There's always going to be somebody that's going to try and knock you down. And you be like, oh, no, he can't they, keep up this type of pace for that long. Bruh, just let, 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 let people develop. And, and then, like, another thing is, too, we used to be up so much, the fourth quarter. Yeah, you'd be out. Out of there. I'd be out. But the thing with this so is. So I could have had more. Yeah. <laughs> could have had 6,000. We talking right. about 5,230 yards. He ain't even played to his junior year. 79 this. touchdowns. <laughs> He could have 7,000 and 140 TDs <laughs> in two years. In high school. In two years. <laughs> How long did you go to high school? Well, my high school from 10th to 12th grade. <laughs> okay, so three years. I really didn't. I didn't, I didn't play really, my sophomore year. <laughs> didn't really play like that sophomore year. So like, I played my season. sophomore year, but. Corner. Yeah, like corner. Like, uh, he gave me some carry and stuff like that. 
But we had a workhorse. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, right. Y'all yeah, had a dog. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Then they had, had the workhorse. Then they had the tank. Yeah. Bro, this is going to be weird. But I the thing with this is, everybody say to say this, you can't measure that heart, though. You can't no. measure that desire and that want to. Look, like, they always try and put those those measurables on folks. But sometimes you. That man right there is different. Sometimes don't work. This Absolutely. man right here is different, bro. Facts. We'll Yo, talk about everything he did, but. I'm talking about from experience trying to hit this mug in practice. We talking about he he, in one of our live periods he 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 can't line this mug up. He's not Frick. here. He's he's, he's here. Now he's not. He, he's running, but he <laughs> but the, like what, what they say he's he's fa he's fast. He make the so, fast people look not fast. So you say your first three games as a junior, you went for three hundred yards a piece. Not three hundred yards in three games. Three hundred yards a piece. So what was the craziest high school game you had? The craziest high school game I had was probably like my. First time starting, I think I rushed for like 320 some yards. Like um, how many TDs? I think I had like four. I had like four. Like, um, my first carry was a tug. Like you know what I'm saying? Like I'm, <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Out the gate. Yeah. You know time. what I'm saying? Like first game starting. Yeah. Uh, first game starting. You know what I'm saying? Stands packed. Like you know what I'm saying? Yeah. The whole city there, like you know what I'm saying. Hey, so Kansas, like the atmosphere, say it's Kansas, yeah. Kansas City got like Kansas shuts Kansas down. Got to like really be about. Football. So it's like yeah. Friday night lights, like, Friday night lights. Yup. The whole everything, closed. the whole city gonna shut down. Stadium got stadium or like the the field that you're playing at probably got what four, five, six thousand people. But like, what, yeah. what would you put at it? Like six? Uh, uh, like five or six. Like you know what I'm saying? Like, but but the city shut down though. Shuts down. Yeah. Like, Everybody coming to watch. You know what time it is. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like. That's yeah. And the thing about Kansas, like we um uh like the high school, whatever, uh, we got our own station, like you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So they got the TV cameras out there, Ooh, like you know what I'm saying? Like high you know school what I'm saying? got its own little yeah. pro yeah. Yeah, like um uh, Production. uh Metro Sports. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Friday so, like, night, Friday night football. Stop Friday playing. night lights. Tune man. in. Oh yeah. Like I tell people like I tell people like like Friday night lights. Like, like nothing like it. Like you know what I'm saying. Mm. Like it's, the, it's Friday night. Like it's, it's the purest form of football. It's, right. Almost. If like, you, hey, if you play Wednesday night in high school, boys didn't even think about you. Right. You was Thursday night. Like, like you play Thursday. For, Sorry. Like if you play Wednesday, you on freshman. Right. You play Thursday, you on JV. JV. Friday, you play Friday, you on see, varsity. Hey, you you know what time it is. You rocking yeah. the jersey to class. You right. Hey, hey. What? Yeah. You hitting the spirit rallies. Man, look, All that in yeah. there. Yeah. It's my time. Right. Yeah. yeah. And That's there. what you remember the most, I feel like. Like Facts. Friday night. The night games. Yeah. High school. The yeah. rivalry games. Yeah. When you didn't have a lot on your mind, like you just doing it for the love of the game. Yep, yep. You With your some, boys. Hey, you had some things on your mind. Oh, yeah. Man. Hey, yeah. <laughs> I know she's feeling Yeah, you know that. That girl you like. I know right. she's yeah. feeling that she feeling but, me. Yeah. But yeah, she like, <laughs> but uh, they uh, they put they, they they got your name on the, on the announcements the next week. What? Yeah. Darren Sproles with the four hundred. Mm. But the um uh, announcement say Darren or say Tay? Nah, but they call me Darren. You know what I'm saying? They call me Darren. There, <sighs> only the family. Like, only um, the family. Yeah. Okay. But like um, when I was a sophomore, whatever. Uh, so I had the senior, whatever. He was like, uh, he was like Sproles, like uh, um, uh, the girls don't like first downs. Uh, like they want to see touchdowns, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I was like, yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? You yeah, feel me? Sir. Touchdowns. Like, <laughs> they like them, they like them highlight plays. Right. Yeah, yeah. sir. Uh -huh. So you you doing all this stuff in high school, like how do you get like how'd you get to Kansas? I'm saying, like, yeah, like what happened with the recruiting process? Everybody's doubting you. They saying they're saying that you putting up 300 yards a game, you're running for 79 TDs, you're running for 5,300 yards, you're the player of the year back to back years. You got every high school rushing record at your school. What's happening with the colleges at this point? Like at this point, like um, Junior, they going no. off my uh, they going off my size. Like you mm -hmm. know what I'm saying. So like on my size, they um and how and how 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 much do you weigh at this point in high school? Yeah, high Junior? school. Um. <laughs> I'm probably like 160 something. Okay. You know what I'm so you still okay. stout though. Yeah, but I'm like 160 something. Like, you know what I'm saying? But I'm just, like. Just to put this perspective, in the league, you played at 201? 180. 185? 185. Yeah. Yeah. I, I thought 185, just 180. Whenever I go sub two, folks be getting upset. I'm like, probably. 200. About 200, that's hefty. I, I ain't never touched 200. Ooh. When I got to like 198, like last year, I'm like, oh man, let me. 
This is let me talk about doing this car. Yeah, this cardio. Like, yeah. Yeah. Like, let me, yeah. Let me cardio. Let me tighten you know up. what I'm saying? Daughter's going to be out there wheeling and dealing right. soon. <laughs> See, but the thing is, it was like um, high school, that, like every college, whatever, they want me to play slot. But I'm like, man, that ain't what my love is. I'm like, you know what back. I'm saying? Yeah, like, man, I'm running back. Like, you know what I'm saying? Ball carrier. So, like, the only school, whatever, that, like, wanted me to play running back was Kansas State. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I had offered, like, from Iowa, from Texas, from from Nebraska, and stuff play like that. Slot. Slot. Like, you know what I'm saying? And you did some of that in co- in high school, or they just figured that you would be good at that? At, uh, I level? did some of that my senior year. Like, you know what I'm saying? They split uh, you out. Yeah. Did you run routes? Yeah. Um, uh, because the thing was, my high school coach, like, knew that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, so he wanted me to like to like. He wanted that film out there with yeah, me. Yeah, yeah. Um, so he so wanted your versatility. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like to see, well, like you know what I'm saying. Way, I can do that. Can do right. Um, That's but good, my though. first love was like carrying that was, rock. Was carrying that rock. Like, like that. you know what I'm saying. And then like toting that rock. Boy. And, and then like um and then like with Kansas State, Coach Snyder like he was like he was like if you come here you are gonna be a running back like you know what I'm saying we want you at running back yeah. Mm. And they offered me, man, my junior year. How far is K State from the crib? It's like forty-five minutes to an hour. Okay, home. Oh, wrong. you was home. home yeah. Hero, right? She hood hero, right? Is it hood? so? Like I was like, That's so cool. I was far, but I wasn't too far, right? But but the thing was was like forty-five minutes ain't far at all. No, nah, <laughs> but but like the thing was for me, for me like when I went on my recruiting trip. I seen like how close the team was. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Um, uh, the team was like a family. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, and that's what I liked about it. And uh, then at the time I, I was going to college, my mom was kind of sick. Like you know what I'm saying? So, so I didn't want to be too far. Yep. You know what I'm saying? Yep. Yep. Um, uh, it just made sense. Yeah. They was giving you the opportunity to carry the ball. Carry you the was ball. Close to mom. Close to home. Hometown right. hero. Well, like, Team is you, close. You got to hey, you got to skirt to the crib. That's easy. That's easy. Enough. It, like, you know it, 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 made, it, made, no it checked all the boxes. It made a lot of sense. Right. And yep. it clearly tuned out. Boy, Went crazy. Why? So when did you develop the shiftiness? And when I say shiftiness, you know what I'm talking about. When you're running, you're never really letting anybody size you up. It's it's I, I, the closest person I think can get to what you what you've been able to do is probably like Marshawn Lynch in just in terms of. You can't size and square him up. Like when I'm going in for a tackle, I'm trying to dial you up. My hips match your hips. I'm still not getting a clean hit on you. Like you're able to turn, twist, yeah, yeah. shift out of most direct hits. Like you don't really take, oh, they smack pros. Right. Um, this is like a pump return, whatever. Like you like, like, you know what I'm saying? Like the ball ain't got there yet. You know right. what I'm saying? And you trying to make something happen. And you should have fair caught, like you yeah, know what I'm saying. Yeah. But you just you like, don't fair catch on. nothing. I, just see, I don't try to, but you know what I'm saying. Like when I'm trying to make a play, you want that touch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like um, it's just that need. Yeah, <laughs> like, give me that. Yeah, I'm out. Like I want that, but like um, but like with me, like when I see a defender like stop his feet, nope, he's done. He's done. Like you know what I'm saying. What was hard for me, um. Like if I break through, I break through, and then that defender like like shoot on me. Shoot, yep. That's when it's got. I'm, I'm, I'm like, oh, cushion. Like, yeah, like yeah. you know what I'm saying. That's when it's hard. Right. You give you know me space, you dead. It's, it's over with. But if it's you if with. you close the cushion, I gotta react quick. Yeah, yeah. 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 Eight times out of ten, I'd be like, shoot your shot. You, you shoot have it. to. Yeah. You have to. Yeah. I'm trying to. I'm trying to shoot the out because I'm trying to shoot the outside. You gonna surprise so you the back? Have to cut back. Right. You gonna surprise the ball carrier? Right. right. You shoot your shot, close the cushion. Now I gotta do something quick. Right. Now, if you sit there flat footed, now I can set you up, boom, 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 see how you react. Right. Dead. But I always love though, like they shoot their shot, they shoot it up high. Mm, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Because you're strong. I'm strong. Your like, daddy yeah. said you don't yeah. be. But if you shoot it like low, like like, like down here, it's tough. Like yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like you like you like because you got to pick. Your you don't know. Up, you're not yet. Yeah. You clip your leg. Clip yeah, your knee. Something. Throws you off a little bit more than you can handle. Yeah. But like the thing was, Sproles, people thought he was smaller, so they thought he wasn't as strong or powerful. Mug quads like a mule, like you know what I mean, like <laughs> uh, mugging their single leg squat and some stuff. I'm like, hey, like, I would say pound for pound, probably the strongest person I've seen in the weight room. Pound for pound, like 
I've seen you put a up dog. some major weights. Like it wasn't Your until ass strong too. Though. I don't, I don't that, hear but that. I don't. Like, I don't. Well, he's really, a big motherfucker. Yeah, though. yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, <laughs> <laughs> but damn, you, like, like I teach. Like, you don't teach size. You know what I'm saying? Right. Like, so I'm able to. That's why I said pound for pound. Because like you were putting up easily. Well, you know, we. I'm we talking bench, bench press, press three plates. He repping, repping. And I, I, I look. I, I was, I was lifting at the time. I seen. Spros, I mean, he only got to go I like Spros, this. Like, like three forty five in. He only got to. Bro, it was like it was like week thirteen. Well, he Sproles got like 345 out here. Mm, 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 mm. I was going for five. He got like, four, like, four, like got five. And I said, shit. I got this. All right, Sproles, I'm going to do what you do then. And now you got it. I need to get under here. And like, but like what my thing was though, like during the season, like if I didn't lift, I, I, see, I would mess around and got down to about 170 something. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm. Like I still had to lift heavy to keep my one, 184, 185. Body, like, you man. know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. Right. You learned yeah. that in high school? Like you lifted in high school? Yeah. Dad yeah. didn't really lift in high school. Yeah. Like whatever, yeah. whatever. Lift in high school, college, like you know what I'm saying? I ain't I ain't touch Olympics. Like I had to. College. But anyways, so we get to we get to high school. You you choose K State. K State. K State. K State. Legend. Legend. True mm. freshman. Love it. True freshman. What you what the what the true freshman year was like for you? Like See, what okay. was your role on the team? Okay. Like, like when I came in, and the true whatever. freshman is like somebody who comes in from high school with intentions to play on the team, right? Not, and whatever capacity that You're is, true. could be a starter, could be a rotational. True freshman is You're like true. you, that guy. That's why you get the red shirt. It means they came in as a freshman and didn't play at all. They sat on the sidelines, they or now develop. Now they, yeah, develop they were them. developed. So now you can play like three or four games in college and not burn a red shirt year, right? And then you you get to see what you can got and then go sit back down. True, mean you in them trenches off. The true, trip. true. You like baseball, you on deck. You on deck, you on deck. You right on deck. now. Right. Hey. So like my freshman year, whatever, I was last on the depth chart. That's what a lot of people don't know. How many you know how running saying? backs was ahead? When you say last, was like four? Like colleges? No. Like it was like five backs, probably. Five backs. You, you know what I'm saying? Like I was five. You know what I'm saying? So four was heady. Okay. So I was yeah. like, but so I, so like. Uh, he was all special teams. So like special, well, not really yet. Like, they had me on scout team. Like, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, I'm on scout team. You're giving them boys headaches, though. That lasted for a week. Like, <laughs> man, I'm was, out there trying to kill them. Like, you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah. I'm out there reversing the field. I'm, 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 Everything. I'm like making me, people you, miss. Like, you yeah, know. you're giving them problems. Right. Y'all so want like, some seasoning? How about some so of like, like, So, like. <laughs> give some of the hint. The thing on, um, um, uh, defensive coordinator was like, um, uh, you like, Spros, man, like, Spros. Put all that juking, like you know what I'm saying? Like run straight. I said, man, that's not me. Yeah. And I ain't finna let these big hit, hit me. me. Like, you know what I'm <laughs> yeah, saying? Yeah, like, yeah. You know, uh, so then, like, um, so then it lasted a week, whatever. He told the head coach, like, hey, like, he needs to be down there with y'all. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so from that time on, I was down there with them. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? But uh, but I think like then, like, um, uh, the movement to backup, you know what I'm saying? I was behind um, you, was, you was second string. Yeah. Hey, I was second from straight. five to second, and hey, yeah. moving on. That's up. a quick. That's a quick ascension. Yeah. You go yeah. from no touches. Like in we the had game a senior, like, like you know what I'm saying. We had a senior in there. You know what I'm saying. Right. Yeah, been there, toting the rock. Yeah, toting the rock. You yep. trusted him, obviously. Yeah. yeah. And you so, were like, in your back of your mind, you. So like, after that, like I am him. Um, they tried to give me like some little plays, put me in space. You know what I'm saying? Make me. Get Seven and a half yards. Right, let's go. Yeah, get a little what they did. Every time you touched it. I know they said first down, they want to see first down. I mean, touchdown, not first down, but you were still averaging almost a first down every time he touched it as a freshman. Seven and a half yards of carry as a true fresh. Ooh, that's what it was? I didn't know that. Seven, five. Mm. Per. Sheesh. As yeah. a true fresh. Yeah, yeah, sheesh. Yeah, I didn't know that. Sproly yeah. 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 touched that rock on first down. It is second and two. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. Dang. Yeah. Yeah, I know Dang. that. Exactly. Dang. Dang. <laughs> Whole playbook open. Yeah. What you, what you want to do? Whatever. <laughs> Give it to Sproles. <laughs> Give it to Sproles. Yeah, Sproles. again, shoot. He's going to get us another seven. <laughs> 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 then you go, go to your second year. You had a senior that graduated, went to the league, whatever. Mm -hmm. you, you, you go into that spring starting? Starting. I'm starting. So it's the Sproles show now. Let's go. Mm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. You know what time it is. Yeah, that's what I... I remember watching Spro, bro, at K-State. Number 43 out there giving people problems. I'm like, yo, this little joker right here is a dog. I remember, <laughs> I remember, I remember watching, fool. I remember, I you remember. Say, you in the Midwest. 
Right. Yeah. He was. I Midwest. mean, I'm Midwest. That's Midwest of the map. Mm-hmm. He was Midwest of the map. Ma- yeah. Right. He's not Midwest. Technically, mm. he kinda. What do you put Kansas? At? We call it Midwest, though. Yeah, it is the Midwest. Midwest. Would you call? It's not the South. Yeah, it's not the you South. You like who go down? It's south like Kansas, it's like though. it's like in no man's land. It's Midwest. That's <laughs> <laughs> why we won't let you claim shit. <laughs> right. No East Coast, no West Coast, right. no South. What it's is Kansas. Come on now, Kansas. Come on now. I officially only know hey. two players. Hey, real. Let me preface this. But y'all know what though? How like many black people in Kansas. A whole Seven. bunch. No, it's a whole bunch. Some families. A lot that had offspring. And then <laughs> that's no, like that's what y'all think. No, but, I don't think. But that. it's like that's what I, yeah, yeah, I know Kansas got brothers. Yeah, uh, the basketball team. No, <laughs> it's like Flint. Oh, yeah, like Ooh. same thing. That's, yeah. he, that's heavily populated. Yeah. Okay. So I'm that like, puts in perspective. I've been there. Yeah. The only place I've been in Kansas is like Wichita. Wichita got some though. You was on the wrong he side. Asked, he asked that. He yeah. asked that earlier. He said, "Kansas got hoods. Everywhere got hoods. Everywhere got hood. Everywhere got that hood. Everywhere got them trenches." Kansas City is normally. I've been like, to Kansas City. They normally like, but that's Missouri State, Kansas City. What is, what is both? It? It's both. They also, they split. Yeah. It's a little it's split. city split down the middle. Yeah, like a street like, right. divide them. But they always top five in uh, murder. Yeah, I could. I could. Yeah, I thought that was the. I thought that was like. What, what, what split's that? <laughs> you talking about St. Louis. Yeah, there we go. I'm, talking, I'm thinking yeah. St. Louis then. Yeah. St. Louis up there too. Yeah. But man, let's talk about this, man. Second year you start, we say it's the Sproles show, right? Sproles. Started all 13 games. Broke eight individual school records. <laughs> <laughs> including rushing yards, 1465. Rushing yards by a sophomore. 100 yard rushing games, 10. Consecutive 100 yard rushing games, 9. All purpose yards, 1800s. Points by a sophomore, 104. And rushing average per carry, 6.18. Fifth Wildcat to score 100 points in the season. Fastest ever to reach 1,000 yards, hitting the mark on your 159th carry. <laughs> 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 so you do that your sophomore year. I mean, well, he broke records in high school. What do you think he was going to do? You can't, you can break I mean, all I, mean, I, mean I mean, they... <laughs> They said he was too small. Right. They. <laughs> they said he wasn't going to be able to do it, it at yeah. the next level. Mm. They said he wasn't going to be. I mean, and by the end of the senior year, they said the same thing about him. Oh, he was a great college they back, continue. but right. they said he was small. Don't do this. Ha ha ha. Then we go to junior year. Now you, you know it's too easy for you now. Boy, fifth in the Heisman voting. Third Associated Press Player of the Year. Big 12 Player of the Year. First team All-American. First running back. And the tenth Wildcat to earn first team All American accolades from the Associated Press. First team. First team. Oh, not man. second team. Yeah, yeah. Hell, I think from I was... the Associated Press. It's AP now. AP. This is what they say. Dang. AP, right? Fifteen games and led the nation to total rushing yards and K State single season record one thousand nine hundred eighty six on three hundred six carries. That's a workhorse. Led the nation all purpose yards with a K State record two thousand seven hundred thirty five. Keep in mind, this all-purpose going to come back up now. All-purpose going to continue to come back up. <laughs> you see this? It, it's, it's a consistent theme here. <laughs> all-purpose. He can- since back in high school, since back uh, in Pee Wee, it's man. a consistent theme here. From, from knee-high to tree-high. They high. say this, and he do that. Stop saying they. <laughs> they was always wrong. Always they wrong. don't matter. Always wrong. They don't matter. They don't know. <laughs> they they don't, don't know him. Like I call them. Him Duncan. <laughs> yeah. Then the boy go to the senior year. Mm-hmm. What they saying about you now, man, after you did this sophomore and junior? What they saying, bro? They still doubt me. Like, you know what I'm saying? So junior year, you go back because they don't give you a good grade. Yeah. In the draft. They don't but think you they, they don't think you can play but, in the league. Yeah. So they told me like um but so they told me no, you do the pre-draft like little right. Give you a grade. Right. They yeah, give you a little like, grade. Yeah. Third or fifth round, me, uh, whatever it is. Fourth round, like you know what I'm saying. Okay. Uh, so I'm like, man, I'm not finna lead school for fourth round, right. like you know what I'm saying. And then um uh that I made a promise to my mom, you know what I'm saying. My mom was like, like Tank, like um uh go back and get your degree, yeah. like you know what I'm saying, like mm. and then leave, yeah. you know what I'm saying. Then my mom passed. My mom passed my junior year, like you know what I'm saying. So like um. Uh, Felt like you had to fulfill yeah, that you, promise. Yeah. Uh, so I went back, like, you know what I'm saying? Uh, 
I went back. Um, went braced. No, like see, um, so like my senior year, whatever. We uh we had a lot of starters leave. Like you know what I'm saying? Like, so like everybody has said that said like had a down year, like you know what I'm saying? Like right. but I still rushed for almost two thousand. Like, 1986. Huh? 1986. Right. But 2735. But so I'm there. like, like, okay, like <laughs> yeah, like uh they were saying like uh um like I wasn't gonna make it, like you know what I'm saying? Like still Still, Still one gonna make it, yeah. Like you know what I'm saying. Like so I always had haters. Like you know what yeah. I'm saying. They always uh, gonna see the the, the measure. So I was always gonna prove them wrong. Like you know what I'm saying. Right. So I went back and got my degree. Whatever. I still went fourth round. Like you know what I'm saying. Uh, but like, you finished your degree. The scouts had said if I would have been two inches tall, three inches tall, like they gonna like, do some like dumb five stuff. eight five nine, then I would have been a first round pick. I'm not gonna lie to you. Suppose how tall are you for for? for? Five seven, so they just wanted one inch, two. Uh, it's crazy. That's dumb. It, by a running back, you trying it's to be crazy. shifty and elusive well, anyway. To me, you want to be low anyway. Yeah, but like your center of gravity is naturally lower. Like right. you know how listen hard to me, doggy bone. The man has done it as a sophomore, as a junior, as a senior. He goes for five one hundred yard games, two two hundred yard games, and two and two one hundred yard quarters. <laughs> <laughs> Like he, hanging you up, he hanging you up in the quarter. And then, then I'd look at the scouts and be like, what are you watching? <laughs> like, what do you, what, is, what is, how did you get this grade? This man's playing football. Like, watch the man tape. What right. do you finish? Finish like fifth in Heisman? Heisman fifth in the Heisman. Days? First fifth team all Big 12. Accolades. And this is the thing though. Accolades, accolades, accolades. Y'all know I'm still mad about this though to this day. Uh-oh. That my junior year, whatever, I had more, more yards. Um, I had a better average, uh, less carries, and I, I did not win the Dope Walker Award. Who won it? You know. Chris Perry won it. Like, Chris you know what Perry I'm saying? From Michigan. Like, if from Michigan, like, he, you know what I'm saying? He did his thing. You know what I'm saying? But you just put out, you put out facts. But my numbers no. was way better. Facts are facts. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hey. You can, hey, yeah. you can, you can argue opinion. Men you lie. You can't argue facts. Women lie. Numbers don't. Numbers don't. But. I never won the doke either. That still bothered me to this day. It still pissed <laughs> you know, me off too. Right. So we, I, I empathize with I'm you. I'm not going right. to lie to you. I didn't even so know your what the year was award was until I left Toby college. Toby Gerhardt. Ah. Toby. Stanford. I, fullback. He ran for hella yards. Fullback. All dives. But versus who? All dives. I respect Toby. He had good NFL That was in career. the Pac-12. Pac-10. Pac-10. Well, 10 Pac back then. Right. Pac-10. I Pac-10. shared the ball with Trent Richardson, who had 900 yards. Right. Like, Ooh. Toby. I would have had, yeah, but I never won the doke either. I like, my thing is, my thing is, how do you win the Heisman and, and don't win the dope, though? That's what I. That's what I was confused about. Yeah, that's 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 crazy to me. But how you have the best numbers in the country? It's, it was crazy to me. And don't win the dope. Sometimes, so it doesn't go to the best. Sometimes, back. sometimes the the, uh, the guys who are scouting the the writers who aren't looking at the numbers, they're like, no, it's not going to translate. Yeah, but translate. I remember yeah. it's not. Okay. I remember Michigan back in that day. They were Michigan, yeah, the powerhouse. Michigan. Chris Perry. I remember. I yeah. remember. I remember. Right. I remember. But also, but my, my thing number. is, look at them numbers. Before y'all crown somebody though, and also look, look what I did the year before, and then what I've done now. It's not a I one did. year wonder. I'm consistently putting up numbers. Yep. Don't don't look at this. How would he get there? Yeah. Yep. Look at what he's done. Yep. Mm. You know, like, and the thing is, like, every since that time, I never watched the Dope Walker like the <laughs> like the little ceremonies. Hey. You're scarred. <laughs> I never watched scarred. it. Me neither. <laughs> never. Me neither. I don't watch no nan. I ain't win one award at that ESPN show. Not one. Not one? Not That's one cool. award. I ain't win one award at that ESPN show. You got that big boy, and, though. And it's not about me, though. <laughs> this, this, this ain't about me. It's about you. But I empathize <laughs> with you. Heisman. The first. Heisman. But first, I feel you, though, in your pain, because I don't watch Nan show that. Right. I ain't win no player of the year, no dope, nothing. I'm like, 
they got me going to Heisman. I'm like, it's no way I could win, right? Honestly, I didn't know that there was other award, like there was an award show for everybody else. I thought it was just the Heisman. Well, they do they do the Belitnikoff, yeah, right? right. They do that's the linebacker the safety. No, the Belitnikoff is the receiver. Right. Which one's the linebacker? Oh, the bucket. Nope. Buck kiss. Buck kiss. Buck kiss. They the do linebacker. the what's the uh, the DB award? Um, <laughs> Thorpe. Thorpe, the mm, Thorpe. They got all those. They awards. got a D line award. The Narguski, whatever D line. Is that they, what it is? Yeah, the Narguski. Bro, I literally. They got an O line award. They got the they, Player of the Year awards. Right. The quarterback. That's how you know I was never in it because I, I never knew about the D line award until I got yeah, out. I stopped. I stopped. They, I'm like, they got, like, they they got, got a best D lineman award. I'm like, they got I me going up to it. New York. I ain't, I ain't yeah, finna win this Heisman. It. I ain't finna win this Heisman. It don't matter, bro. It, it still got you, got you to the league, fourth round. 100, fourth round. 140th? Hmm? 140th pick? It was something like, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. 130th, 130th pick. 30th? That, don't let me disrespect Chargers. you. That's, yeah, what, what, what's that, the fourth round? That's yeah, the fourth, fourth round. round. Yeah. But it's okay. Before we start talking about this, in a, this amazing, look, I had an amazing high school career, uh, a phenomenal college career, and we're going to get to this illustrious NFL pro, pro football career. We do a little quick Spanning teams. We're going to get to this. Uh, you know, quick hit segment. And hey, and you know, cause you used to eat all the time in the two minute drill. Mm, you love two minutes. Two minutes. Hey. <laughs> you love two minutes. That two minutes. You say, hey, hey, you know, that's money, huh? Yeah. Catches, runs, everything. That boy rack up them yards, right? Real quick in two minute drill. So we do a little two minute drill. Cam gonna fire off some. I'm gonna fire off some questions. So here we go. Start the two minute drill. Ready? Bomb. Yep. Grass or turf? Turf. Stadium or dome? Dome. Favorite jersey combo. Of the, your NFL career? Um, hot or blue? Mm. Screen or flat? What? Run the screen or run the flat? Screen. All oh, day. It's not even close. Spades or Uno? Uno. I'm Uno. Who's your GOAT running back? Barry. Who's your GOAT quarterback? Breezy. Strongest arm in the league? Mahomes. Which running back has the best hands in the league right now? McCaffrey. Fastest player in the league. Tyreek. Cool Ranch or Nacho Cheese Doritos? Cool Ranch. You a real one. Vanilla ice cream or chocolate ice cream? Vanilla. What was your 40, what was your 40 time? Do you remember? 441. Ooh. Max bench press. One minute. Four or five. Hmm. Favorite touchdown. Had to been in New Orleans. Uh when we played San Fran in the playoffs. The choice route. Ooh. Choice route. Uh, let's go. Yeah. Favorite teammate? That's hard. That's hard. Antonio no, Gates? There's a lot nah, of y'all. Oh, yeah, God. yeah, real one. I thought I'll just throw one out there. Favorite TV show? Martin. Ooh. Favorite football movie? Um, Remember the Titans. Your most famous friend? Most famous friend? Yeah, you got a lot of famous friends. I do. Y'all. Who else? <laughs> Cap. That's not it's right. Be true. That's no. big cap. <laughs> Y'all famous. Best, <laughs> best rapper alive. Best rapper alive? Best rapper alive. Jay-Z. First Two celebrity minutes. crush. First. When you was a jit. Who you think about? TV timeout. Ooh, the first? First. Celebrity crush. When you dang I like Two minutes, ten seconds. The girl's doing something for me. Who was it? Damn. Um uh New York calling for a review. Two um, minutes and twenty seconds. Neil Long. Ooh. Punt return or jet sweep to the house? Home return. Favorite NFL stadium? New Orleans. Least favorite NFL stadium? Two minutes, 30 seconds. Injury Least timeout. Least favorite? Um, whenever the Rams were in St. Louis. Mm. Hated it. Best concert ever? Post of the Challenge Flag 240. Um, um, old school concert. It was a... Uh, uh, Genuine? No. Older. Luther? No. Charlie Wilson. The broadcast. Mm. The broadcast right. about to shut us off. <laughs> two fifty five. All right. Let, let me get two. Let me get two more. Favorite NFL jersey, not yours. Favorite. Favorite NFL jersey, not yours. I don't know. I, I don't really. I don't know. They're going to Sunday like Night games? Live. It's over. Over hard. Didn't get to finish the game. Scrambled. Your scramble? No, I was. You could go scrambled over hard, or you could no, just I have like over hard. Okay. Over hard. Not too many drill. It's okay. It was great. That's great. I, I derailed him real quick with my little insert. Yeah, so I feel I, like I, right. yeah, yeah, so okay. I had, I had to get okay. my name in the proper okay. I'm just here as a facilitator. Was, uh, <laughs> when I said Jay Z, he said, oh. 
<laughs> now I got hey, discrepancy hey, with that one, bro. No, nah, it's old school. Yeah, you know, hey. look, I get that, but Wayne, old school, but but Wayne like, at but one like, point was dropping mixtapes every month. Wayne, and they were yeah. that, that's mine too. But yeah. but Jay's a little older than us too. He was dropping no mixtapes like that. He don't. He's just blueprint. But Jay, but. But, uh, but so, that blueprint went though. It did. And uh, and I will give you this. I, Jay I that guy now. I dislike Jay-Z's music because my brother was in love so much. It's like, I didn't want to hear him no more. You know what I'm saying? Like, all right, can we listen to something else? He was so Jay-Z. I was like, I like man. Wayne. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I like Wayne. Like old Wayne though. Like the, right. You know Hot Boys. Wayne, yeah. Bro, Nightmares from the Bottom. Like, yeah. he was, he was like, but my new, like. Like my new age right now, little baby man, little, little baby, baby be going go. crazy. Little, little, baby, little baby go, little baby could be going crazy. Yeah. He's, he's on top right now of the rankable people. Right, there's some people that are unrankable. Drake, Future, they're unrankable. Right, but the rankable people, he's on top. Yeah, I like the people. I like future. I mean, there's Future and Drake. They're unrankable. Like they're right. they've been doing it for over a decade. They're only thing about Future though. Like a whole album of future, like you listen to a whole album of future, you, you kind of go, you kind of go crazy a little bit. You know what I'm saying? Like, like what album though? I'll say. Like look, what album makes you go crazy when you listen to it? Like, not this latest one, but the last one he had. He like you kind of, you know like, what I'm saying? When you go to that space, like you just right. start experimenting with stuff. Like, you, when, right. Like, I'm, like, like, I'm like, man, like, like you go like have when to Lil chill Wayne out. did like the whole rock, rock pop, like you feel me, like. Yeah. They just start experimenting with stuff. Right. You know? Like you get bored. <laughs> or not even bored, just like don't box me. Bro. Don't like right. when he dropped, but when he dropped the Hendrix, when he dropped the future, That's you could it. drop that front to back, like vibes. Like Right. No doubt. That's just like Drake's latest one. There's a lot of lot like of he just backs. played like, like bro, he's just checking something else out. Yeah, he Check just he's just playing. Like he's and he probably gonna sell he more wants international to be, records on this be, one than anything he else. Is, though. He wants to be <laughs> played is. in the dressing room at Bally's. Whatever, man. He wants like, to be played over there at like, um, like Zara and uh, Forever Twenty One. Twenty One. You go into the dressing room, you're hearing that new album. Right. You will be in France, and you will hear his new stuff. Yeah. Like it's 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 Most for definitely. it's for the world. Most yeah, definitely. it's. They and he start, already they, said he was gonna come out with another album at the end of the year. Like, yeah. did he, he say? Yeah, he said he said. Look, because whenever Drake raps, he snaps. It's just not up for it's not up for contest. It's not up for debate. Yeah. Whenever he raps, it's just there's always like he tried out singing on one of the albums. You're like, bro, that's not you. But then it sort of became him. Like, well, he does it for the ladies. The, the ladies love it. <laughs> like, I Drake, don't. Hey, they like flesh. Drake got hits though. I don't. Hits. Hits. He hits. starts crying and whining on the track. I don't love it. They say don't Drake and drive, and that you know it was a, it was a situation for a minute. You know, don't Drake <laughs> I and don't drive. love it. But every time he you raps, start texting your ex. Don't do it. Ooh. Texting the ex. When you was in college, they were like, "Don't drink and Ooh. drive." Maybe no. that was just when I was in college. They're like, <laughs> don't, "Don't drink, drink and, and drive." <laughs> not that, not the crying and stuff. Right. You were there. Next thing you know, you. Maybe it's not feet. crying. It's some form of singing that the lady somewhat like. <laughs> you just here for the snaps. Uh, yeah, I just want to hear that man go crazy. <laughs> yeah. Cipher, cipher, Drake. Right. And not a rolly. It's the stop. Why I did the never stop? <laughs> this is that keep the black eye. Got super hot. <laughs> Give me my respect. <laughs> I just took a left like I'm Emma Dex. Yeah. yeah. London with the year was still. You got a sneak deal tonight. I swear. You're going to get Mark started. Yeah. You're going to get Mark oh. started. Uh, hey, you, know, you know Mark before a game started. Oh, I'm not new to this. I'm true to this. Mm. Boy, he going to start snapping. Oh, I see but you. I see you with the though. jeans walking in. But if you know what I mean, I walk in with them ball mains. Yeah. He go, you got a ball, ball man. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Ski. But before a game, what? What music would you listen to? Would it that, change? Hey, or hey you, you ain't no real Jeezy man, fan. Like, you ain't know. no real Jeezy fan, Sproz. He know. <laughs> he know. He know. Okay. I got to put that Jeezy on, man. Really? I, got, I got to. That old. Ooh. Yeah, that old Jeezy. You know Ooh. what I'm okay. I can, I can semi get with it. Hey, but that's that's a that's an OG right yeah. there, though. I, I can that semi. Or die? You know, look, for me, it's you not like about- Gucci, like you need- Oh, I, 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 I like Gucci, Gucci when he was like before the before the before, lockout. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Not, not the clone Gucci. Trap um, Gucci. <laughs> trap, yeah, trap. Yeah. Major, major vibes. I liked, uh, but you know, I'm a, I'm a high energy guy, so I grew up loving, you know, like Buster Rhymes. Buster, uh, you probably energy, you uh, probably man. listen to Mystical Danger. <laughs> Danger, hey, you can't tell me that. The Get energy. on the floor, so please show me. Yeah. Oh, love. Oh, <laughs> Come on, Bob. what you got in there right now, man? You know I'm really before a game. I'm really in the trenches with it. Gucci, 
Boosie, yeah, Dolph, Dolph, yeah, Dolph, Future, I Dolph for a game? OG Dolph Wayne, for a game. yeah, that real OG Jeezy. But sometimes, like, hey, sometimes you come in too amped up. I literally will throw on classical music. I'll be like, yo, I'm too way too wild. But that's like an I'm hour before here. kickoff, though. Like, this is like that's right like an hour before we go on the field. Like this is before like, like a, we go on the field field. Like, like a, sometimes you know, you know how I get pregame, bro. I, I start headbutting folks. I go to, I, I go from like we chilling to yo, it's time to beat like, somebody. I just get too hyped sometimes. Yeah, yeah sometimes, sometimes you, hey, gotta, you gotta you I gotta, gotta like, stuff like down. when I'm warming up in the hot tub getting stressed, like I might I'm throw on a little gospel or Sunday. I wanna play. I, I like a little like a little praise and worship. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Oh, then play. I get into the zone where it's like, no, nah, like. I'm ready to kill some, and See, that's, that's when that Dolph and that and that Gucci and that Boosie yeah. and that Jeezy and that and that, that, and to and the that Trish baby. Yeah. See, that's the point where I start playing something slower. You know what I'm saying? Like when I'm when I'm all the way up here, relax, Cam. Hey, Fangs, Calm hey, down. Fangs is out hey. here. Huh? Relax, Cam. That's when I start playing Sunday Service. Like that bring right. me back down. Like my thing is, my thing is like when I go out there for warm ups, like I got to be here. Whatever. No, you got to come back in. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Come back in and chill. That's when I got something like mellow on. You know what I'm right. saying? To kind of calm me down. Got to. Yeah. I you know you get too hype. Yeah. Too hype. You start getting too tired. Yeah, like, you, I be you like, do. Because like, you exert energy. Like, yeah. and you need that energy to be for the game. Be you, like, yeah. 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 See, for me, I just get too hype. If I get too hype, that's when I get like early jumping off sides. Like, I'm like, I'm trying to kill somebody now. But like Relax, me, Cam, we gotta wait to the game. Wait, I wait, be right. calm, like I be like, once Saturday hits, like I just be trying to like just go into like this like calm like Zen phase, right? Like, cause I just be like, I just feel my stuff just like start like boiling. Like I be ready, just like I be ready. You be antsy, you be kind of yeah. anxious. You want to play well, you want to do well. As a rookie, goes for fifteen hundred twenty eight kickoff return yards. Third year makes history, returning the kickoff and a punt for his first two NFL touchdowns. First player in league history ever to do so. League history now. League, league history. history. Yeah. Not just like, the city, was the that, world, you, Craig. You sent, you sent your history. jersey up to Canton or like which one? Like, did the, did the cleats go up to Canton? Like, that's probably your first time, like, something got the boxed. Jersey and, went up there. Okay. Jersey went up there. A lot of stuff went on, went up there. I, I, so I the third been. year was a nice year for you. You also yeah. ran for your first two TDs and also your first 100 yard game on 12 16, 2007. Mm. Ever the Lions, right? The I don't Lions? know who was versed, but you did it. Yeah. Mm. But in the history now, that's a Ken. Hey, that, that repetition here. It's going to be some right. more history mm -hmm. being made. Mm -hmm. 2008, second player in NFL history, 50 rushing yards, 50 receiving yards, and 100 return yards in one game, the other being Gail Sayers, <laughs> Hall of Fame. 103-yard touchdown return. I'm just saying, there's a lot of all-purpose yards. and It's going to keep coming up. All purpose, not it's just repetitive. running back, not just slot, not of just it. returner. Don't get bored of the greatness here. All purpose. Don't get bored of the greatness. <laughs> Don't get bored of the consistent repetition. Darn near booby miles ish. He can run. Uh, he can pass. He can. <laughs> he, he, can he can pass. <laughs> he can walk wash your dog. Fill up dog. your Gatorade and cooler wash and car. paint your back porch. <laughs> the boy can flat out play some football. <laughs> <laughs> And he can pass. Plan. That's my boy. <laughs> he can run left. No, bro. <laughs> then them boys put the tag on you. Franchise you know twice. what that tag means? Two times? Got that twice. The double tag? So you really, ooh, by the light of Again, my that, you know what I want. That franchise tag don't seem like a lot of players like, I want that deal. But Man, also, I was taking it. Franchise tag equals top five money because it takes the top five players at your position, meshes them together, gives you the average, and they say that's your check for the year. Right. And then if they hit you with it the second time, it's what the, I just said plus like 10%, 15%, 20%. 10, it's, it's, yeah, it's, a, it's, a, it's a percentage on there. It's a gratuity yeah, added. Yeah. Oh, we appreciate uh, it. We want to use this tag. Unless it went up now. It yeah. might have went up. But right. listen here. In the tag season, you go for 343 Rushing yards, three rushing touchdowns, 45 receptions, 497 receiving yards, and four receiving touchdowns, 54 kick returns, 1,300 yards, and 26 punt returns, 183 yards, and a touchdown. That's what you Netting. call betting on yourself and hitting. Ooh. Then they tagged you again. They tagged me again. 59 receptions, 520 yards, two touchdowns, 50 carries for 267 yards, 51 kick returns for 1,257 yards, and 24 punt returns. Like I said, the, the 520 yards, the 267 rushing yards, like it may look light. And that's, the, you know, 520 no, in the air you and 267. But then you add them up and you're like, ooh, that's pretty decent. 
That's that that's, a, that's never a starter, though. And then you add on the you was behind LT then, right? LT. But yep. then but then you add on the fifty one kick return for the twelve fifty seven. Like the all purpose. All we purpose. we pushing it's, it's two crazy. we pushing two K almost every year. So you say what you want. That's production. Production. You say what you want. That's pushing two K yards on the franchise tag year. So you got tagged once, got tagged twice, then you get bagged up by the Saints. Mm. That's where I met my dog. That's where I met my dog. The, in that f- boot, huh? In that, in that boot, boot. Where we were getting loose. He was there for what, three? He was there for three? Three or yeah. four? Two. I was there three, man. Three? 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 Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He was there for three years. Hey, it was yep. a good time. Four-year contract with the Saints for that bag. Broke over a thousand all-purpose yards in his seventh game. <laughs> We ain't even halfway through the season. Boy might not even had a, a, a break yet, boy. Like you ain't even hit your bye week. Hey, by the way, thousand. We ain't even halfway through the season. All purpose. Ready. We was rolling that year though. And Bruh. then he finished we 2011 with 2,696 all purpose yards, breaking the NFL season single season record previously set in 2000 by Derek Mason. Mm. Record. In the history. All purpose. In the history. Do not get bored with this repetition, my people. This is greatness. <laughs> I'm trying to tell you, this all purpose is going to keep popping up. This Y'all all come, purpose. All purpose king. This history, it's going to continue to pop up. Don't get bored with it. It's greatness. <laughs> I, got, I got a question for both of y'all. Do, do y'all get nervous before games? I heard that it was a thing. And like, I, you know, like I some guys, nervous. some guys like throw up or tighten up. Or no, do I don't do none of that. Uh, me, I, don't I don't throw do up or tighten up, but I do have an anxious, nervous feeling because I want to play well. Like, I want to play well. So you do have like butterflies in the stomach. Is yeah. that what that is? You, yeah, you got that. Never got that. But the problem is, <laughs> like, I just want to choke some life. <laughs> that your defense though, yeah, bro. Yeah, that, that defense, defense is different, but, bro. But you still see guys like some of like they be so wide, like, man, we got. Hey, all you gotta hey, do is go hit something. Like, how's this still look, bro? If you don't sit your ass down, relax, bro, my boy. All you gotta do is hit life. something, bro. You gotta yeah, go it. and hit something. Like, we got a lot of stuff we gotta do. Like, we got this route. We got this protection. We got these people. If they don't pressure, we got this route. But if this he audibles, thing, this is my thing. You break the huddle sometimes. You got three plays. You broke the huddle with three plays. Like, you know what I'm saying? You got to get up there, read the coverage, like, see what they're doing. Just, um, if you audible, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You, you got to know what the audible is. Not you, like that, you know too. Yeah, yeah, you got to know it like that, too, because that mug might say, you know, you be like, Yeti, Yeti. Yeah. Is that hot, hot? You be like, oh, wait, ooh, ooh, yeah. ooh. Yeah, right. Oh, boom, like, you gotta, ooh. Right. It's different. But I like, tell people, though, I tell people, though, if you don't have a great quarterback, like. Does it make it easier or harder? Harder. What, harder. Like, ten times harder. Ten times harder. I was gonna say, sometimes if you don't have a, ten, like, if you don't not have, communicating. If you don't have you, a great quarterback, right. I was just thinking, like, it's, if you don't if, hard. if you don't have a great quarterback, that means you can't go in with audibles like that. You gotta you gotta drive. When Buddy comes in with that strap on his on his arm, I'm assuming y'all only going one play. When you have a There's Phillip Rivers or, on there, though, or, right? They got one. They got here. And then they, they lift it up. One, and they, got, they got more. But they but got about it's 60, 70. But, that's what I'm saying, but I'm just saying, when you don't have like a great mind, like you have a Tom Brady, you have a Drew Brees, you have a Peyton Manning. You you know they got four, com- 50, four or five checks when they're the same. That you're makes it scary. Though. But when you go in and you know you got this this freshie or like you know this like rookie type quarterback or this guy who's talented but he's not mentally well, they're right. trying to take stuff off his plate. Right. Yep. So they, they have to- they have they have the center calling the mic. Okay. So this plays are still going. It's just coming from different areas. They're trying to take hey. stuff off his plate. Right. Right. So when when you have a coach that's calling it in, hey, versus somebody who can audible, does that change anything? What what you say now? Hold up. Let's what just you, let's just be real. Let's call it the Rams twenty nineteen. I'm not going to say what the quarterback is. Okay. When you have Golf. somebody, you somebody who like puppeteer. When you have like a you know somebody calling in the plays every time, and it looks like you know the head coach is calling everything. Does that make it easier or harder versus somebody who's like a Tom Brady or a Drew Brees who can check four times with, within twenty five seconds? The Drew Brees and like Tom Brady and Phillip, like who can who can like right. change stuff. It makes it way easier on you. They'll really? tell you what to do. Right. It won't even be the play. You ain't even got to do much like that, thinking like that. You know what I'm saying? Okay. But like you see something, you're like, okay, like he come, but uh, but then like with a great quarterback, a great quarterback be like, hey, he about to come. Yeah. You know be what I'm like, saying? Watch him. Then you know. Yeah. Or he'll be like, get out. Yeah. Like, I'm let's go. Yeah, yeah. He he know this guy not about to peel with you. 
and he just gonna dump the ball to you. Cam Newton versus Luke Keekley when Luke Keekley was like, "Oh, I seen this play." He's like, "Oh, you seen that? Huh? You seen it on t- on tape? Watch this." And yeah, not nah, switch it up. Yeah, that, yeah, that was that was that, that was the aura was, was yeah, yeah, like switch it like yeah, don't yeah, worry about yeah, this check. It was somebody, man. Uh, but I remember Drew one one year, whatever my first year, in my first year, whatever. So you know how uh you know how like uh okay like we have a Sunday night game we got that walk through Sunday morning whatever he came to me he came to me with like Sprozy like um if I give you this like you know what I'm saying yeah right and you line up like an empty like you know what I'm saying um I want you to run the wheel like you know what I'm saying yeah so I'm like I'm like all right like you know what I'm cool. saying I'm like cool second play of the game gave it to you it versus Miami. Gave it to me, hit. I said, man, how he know? Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He watched it, something that whole it, Saturday he, 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 night. That, that whole that Saturday night and got it. Like, yep. you know what I'm saying? He watched something. Yeah, like, like that's the difference like between like the great quarterbacks and just the good quarterback. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because he sees something and he know he need that. It'd another be crazy. Yeah, another quarterback just going to run like, was called he, in. Right. You know, he just going to run was called in. Drew came to him, walked through like, listen, I see something. I know something. Like, I'm going to get you open. It's, like, like, man, like it was crazy though. Like, I'm like, oh, okay, like this. But even like, this, even like this when, is difference. like sometimes Drew, like we'd have to scan back and go get a, uh, a pressure. And he'd just be like, bluff him. Like, he'll be like, bluff, bluff him. Bluff him, yeah, I'm gonna dump yeah, it. I'm gonna dump it to you. You, you. Nobody's there. Like, there. it's cover zero pressure. I'm going for the win. It's cover zero pressure. He wants you, you in You know the everybody flat. coming, yeah. but you got to stall him out just a little quick. He, he, wants, he wants you in the flat. He don't want you blocking. Right. right. He wants you to bluff the blitzer so he could, Give you a ball right. in space. Like, that boy different. Right. Like, different. he told me one time, too. Crazy. Like, uh, like for a zero, like, you know what I'm saying? If he got choice called, whatever. Like, if he could be zero, like, yeah. um, uh, then once you run a flat. Like, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, yeah, yeah. So he was like, Sprozy, like. Don't run a flat. Yeah, like, run your route, but break it inside. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I did it. It, it was nobody there. I said. He knows so. He know. You might yeah. be one of the few people I can ask this. You might be one of, like. Probably not. You're probably the only person I can ask this. And you could pass if you want to. Because that's, you're not. You know. <laughs> What's the difference between playing with Phillip Rivers and playing with Drew Brees? Well, really nothing different. Like Same mental process. Same. The, same, the same because Phillip learned, learned from, from Drew. Drew. Mm-hmm. I said there's not too they many got the same. They got the same. It's, he process, can't, ain't no way he's as, like nobody's as anal as. Drew, when it comes to like where he wants receivers, where he wants like the not like of that, right? But I'm saying, but like the preparation and stuff like that, mm-hmm. like they're the same. Okay, yeah, but like Drew was like that, just like meticulous. that next, like like yeah. if you was if you was on the like hash mark, he like he like Drew no. was meticulous. I tell people, I'm like in that walkthrough, you drop a pass or you run the wrong route, he not coming to you. Nope. He's not. not coming to you, bro. You can see receivers like they line up and it don't even matter if you MVP of the league. No, nah, he was like he be like hmm. Yeah. Like, oh, if you want a hash mark, I want you right here. You'd be like, bro, what is this one foot difference going to do? But it's it's whatever yeah. that separation that no. he saw in his mind that he visualized. Now, one of that his guys, that? like if it's Sproles or Jimmy or Colson, like he'll let it slide. But if you're one of them guys that's like a rotational guy and you come in here and you ain't where you're supposed to be and you drop the pass and Saturday walk through thinking it's a walk through, you're not going in. <laughs> or you ain't getting that ball. You, you, yeah. <laughs> you're not going in. So you might as well not go <laughs> in. So you're not going to get the ball. Cause he don't trust like that you. That Saturday, yeah, he don't trust that you. That Saturday, you got to know where you supposed to be at. You know what I'm saying? You don't know your depth, everything. Like, you right. know what I'm saying? Trust goes a long way. Yep, go a long way. You know the difference, like between like a great quarterback and a good quarterback. Yeah, mm. mm-hmm. it's you know it's it. different. You know it, especially when like yeah. you just have like a good quarterback. You really got to know everything. You know so it's saying? more it's more of a burden on you if you just got like a, co- a quarterback. It's not really like a burden, but but like you really got to know your stuff. Yeah, right. it's more of a burden on everybody for yeah. real because there's a communication aspect when you have a Drew or a Tom Brady or a Philip. Like they're they're directing everything, they're communicating everything. When you have a block in the communication, like the center calling out the mic or the center changing the protection, like the back can't hear the. You know what I mean? The quarterback ain't calling it. So there could be a mishap in the protection where yeah. they slide and who they designated the mic. You know what I mean? There could be a break in the communication as opposed to when the quarterback is doing it. They walk up to the line, they tell everybody. You walk up with him, he, you hear it. Like, it's just a little, it's, it's, everything right. runs smoother. Mm. Like one of the best like centers like to ever do that 
is um Kelsey. Yeah, in Philly. In Philly, Jason like, Kelsey. That's the only person I like. I knew, like you know, what I'm saying because you came. He from, can see like the safety rotation. He can see all that because right. you came from Philly. Call it out. You came from Drew, so you had the quarterback giving you. Giving me the point. Like, you know and, what I'm saying? And then you go to the center giving you the mic. It, change, it, it, it changes. It changes. It's different. It's, yeah, different. it's different, different for you. It's just different. Like, it, 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 yeah, it's different. Quarter, quarterback, had, quarterback turning and giving you here, here, here. Right. Center like. Well, because he <laughs> think he just talking to his lineman. No, right. I need to hear you. Right. Mm. Right. Then if it's loud, you got to walk up there and be like, hold on. What's, what's the call? Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm. So that's, yeah. The quarterback just want the ball. Like Right. Like. I need this play, or you're gonna get hit in your you head. Yep. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes we have like dummy points too, though. Like, you know what I'm saying? Right. So you I really got gotta to know fake, that point. Yeah. So you gotta know if he's actually if, yeah. with, the, with the with the real. Go ahead. I'll Man. say so, you know, as, as you've been a running back from age eight to age 36, tank out here getting elusive, breaking, breaking tackles. Going for an 80 the first time you touch that thing. Going for 300 yards, three consecutive games in high school. Go to, you know, K-State. Break all types of records. Go for stupid yards. All purpose. Hit the league 130th overall, which don't mean nothing. means you got a shot because, you know what I'm saying, anything beyond the first or second round. You can get cut year one. Okay. I done seen third rounders get cut. Yep. Fourth rounders get cut. Year one. Don't mean you in the league. It means you have a chance to stay in the league. Get to the league. They want you to be there. You can also get outworked. Yep. You get there. So anyways, that, that 28 years, I just want to say, like, what is your most favorite route as a running back? What is, and I, and I want to ask you a two-prong because I got this thing with front and the bike. I ain't writing no square there. You need the ball there. in space. You, need to, you want the I need, ball. I want to know your favorite route as well as your favorite run. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you if it's up to you, would you rather go outside, inside? You know, you can give me whatever you want to give me there. And I need your favorite route. Would you want to swing? You want a choice? You want one of them little arrow jumps? What's the little... Hey, hey, this what's your the one camera right here. When you, when you explain it... What do, you want? Like, what? So, what first? whatever you want, bro. Yeah, whatever you want. It, it's, it's you. You want to get open. You want the ball. You want the rock. I do. Favorite run, favorite yeah, route. Probably, that's probably more run. You want to come out the backfield? I didn't. I didn't. That's on me. You want to come up? So, you could go to the other side. There's a little bit more space if you want to do route concept. That's what I'm saying. That's that's the this one could be run. Yeah, <laughs> this yeah. probably run. You want the ball? You want to you want to be in the slot? You want to come out the backfield? You want to be out wide? You want to be a slot? You want to run the seam? You want to run? You know I want the H pirate. You want to run the choice? Which which you want, bro? Also, what's the H pirate? H pirate is we see on film that. Your linebacker's playing flat footed because he's been beat by the choice. He don't want to get beat out. He don't want to get mm. beat up across his face. So he's playing flat footed. So I get up, That's get on his toes. Choice, it's, it's not yeah. really supposed to be matched. But okay. but look, he's playing flat footed. I right. see it on film. So now, now nervous. So now I release like it's a choice route. I give him a little hint, and now I'm like a wide depart fade on him. Gotcha. Big post on the outside for Mike T or Jarvis Landry, some of that sort. Tommy Lee, I mean, uh, not Tommy Lee. I mean, Lee. Yeah, Tommy Lee. But Deontay, it could be Tommy yeah, Lee. Yeah, Deontay, Deontay Hardy. Harris, Deontay Hardy. Lee, big post. Like now I'm in space, one on one with your backer. He's dead. Mm. It's a, one on Tennessee. It's a last choice year. route. You, you like the choice? That's me. Nah, hey, the there it is. Route. Tell him what it is, Prozzy. Ace choice. So with me. Hey, turn, yeah, right where there. Where we at? Where we at? Yeah. This camera's on, yeah. So right there, and just yeah. the way you line up that H, so, that 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 back in the backfield, I know it's a pass. H it's choice. what I call super chow. Stack, right. stack, stack alignment. Stack it. I'm gonna hop out. I'm gonna get the coverage. You know what I'm saying? And then if this linebacker across my face, this is where I'm taking. That's where the money at. You know yeah, what I'm talking about? That's where the big. That's where that yeah. honey hole at. That's where that. Yeah. That's where that money at. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So that's my. If he sits inside. Love. So if he sits inside. I'm going out. Zone. I'm uh, hook it up. Uh, I'm just gonna hook up right there. Yeah. Then that's it. Yeah. Hey, that's pro special. That's how I learned that's how to run my choice routes. <laughs> Watching this cat right here. You got three. Abuse right. so people. If you, if you just a true H. And it's hey, run. hey, you should. Hey, they should have charged you for battery and assault, bro. How you ran them choice routes on people? Uh, I know you got some pending charges for battery and assault. Hey, that was how he how he. Like I said, hey, fa hey, favorite run. Beating them linebackers out outside, 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 inside, tall, run sweet. Like, a, uh, like draw, um, I like outside zone, duo. You give me a duo too? Yeah. I can make that shake too. 
You know so you saying? ain't got a favorite one. You just, nah, nah. You got a draw? Hey, honestly, I thought, I, thought, I thought it might be a toss for you. You hit that outside with all that space. Uh, I thought you See, was I going. Really I didn't really like tosses like that. I but swear. I promise I didn't really Man, like they, toss. Toss sometimes is a setup, yeah. bro. Sometimes it's it is. It's a setup, bro. Like, mm -hmm. y'all be running yeah. like. Like, I like the duo um, inside zone, outside zone. A little zone. misdirection. Yeah, misdirection. With, with, with pullers. Yeah. I like I like the outside. See, zone too. see, listen here, man. This Feed is me. a true running back. <laughs> Feed me. See, you know people what think my he a scat back. Was, though? What? what? Um, what's the speed draw like? Oh, the nickel. Uh, not the nickel forty. The one it, we used to come and boom, boom. And yeah, then, and then like uh, what was it? Colt. Colt. Colt special. Yep. Colt right, special. I'm let you draw yeah. this one up. That was mine. Colt special. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna let you. I'm gonna let you do. But I don't even know what that oh, means. Oh man. Yeah. So basically, it's like a push draw pull. Like yeah, it's basically like a third down. It could be Mid? second. It could be. It could yeah. be second. It could be any down, really. Yeah, any down. Distance. So it's Colt forty special. It could be long. Like, you Q is like here. The long. H okay. is here. So basically, it's like a form of a draw, a delayed draw. Yeah. With a puller too. Yeah, y'all said fast draw. So, so basically, gonna, that defeats the purpose. So of basically, yeah. they actually gonna throw you. Mm. They gonna throw yeah. you and then go. So so he, the tackle quick sets you. Right. Throws you inside. And he pulls out like this. The back sells like he's, the back sells like he just sits there. And the quarterback brings it to him, brings it to him and gives him outside handoff. Mm. And the back just chases the outside hip. Gotcha. And you're in space. So, a lot it's, of space. so it's either a TFL or you got a lot of space. Yes. With someone like Cam Jordan, we probably run this to the other side. Other side. Yep. We got a, when you got a premier DN, mm. someone who's dangerous who will probably sense that he's letting me win inside right. and I'm going to redirect outside. Sometimes you might be too late for someone like that. That's what I'm saying. You so might be too late. That's when it's either TFL or you, you out yeah. in space. Because right. I got to, like, now that I realize but I've been up, I got to shoot but that. preferably we'll go to the weaker right. DN. Yeah. Or unless you're just over aggressive. Like, Clowney might be aggressive on this. You know what I mean? Right. Sometimes, though, with, like, with Sean. I think that's, I think that's about kind of right. Sometimes what with Sean would do, though, if you have like an aggressive end, yeah. whatever, he, he would tell like the tackle to set on him and then have like the inside the guard or somebody pull. Like the you guard, the guard go yeah. out. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So I go in first. Right. Give a little give, back a little, out. give a little hesitant, yeah. if you will. Cold. Hesitation. Cold. Y'all don't run cold no more, huh? Huh? We still run cold. They run cold? Okay. Yeah. They, they, they love to get AK to cold. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> he out of pocket. Uh, no, love to get AK to <laughs> My dog. I, I'm not the first choice on the Colts. Never. You know what I mean? But it's okay. In Mark's eyes, he's never the first choice. Saints. Unless Saints, it's uh, unless Saints unless, unless, unless Saints, it's 13 Saints personnel leading. with the ex receiver who's not, you know, our premier receiver. And I'm Saints in there leading, with all tight ends and leading. Leading. And you want to give NFL me NFL active. Well, leading I mean, rushing. they just want me to run up against the brick wall a lot of the time. But you know, I'm gonna do that. Whatever you give me, I'll make it work. NBI so sees a lot play. of eight bucks, a lot of nine bucks. I mean, last year, <laughs> I don't want to say anything, but last year, I'm not the, you know, the back-to-back -back rushing tank champ, but I somehow see 10% more eight man in the box than Derrick Henry. I don't know why or how. Maybe it's the personnel, you know, maybe who knows what it is. But um, I don't want to say anything. <laughs> tell me to change. <laughs> it's all much. good. Yeah. <laughs> tell me to change. It's okay. There's pride in that. Hey. I'm gonna make it do what it do. Yeah, there's pride in Regardless, that. Regardless, I can't control what they <laughs> do. I can't control what they give me or what personnel. Come on, let's let's right. get back. To, look, 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 look. We still got we still got uh we got a lot. You go all these years with the Chargers and then come to the Saints. After two franchise tags, you expected a bag from the Chargers. Yeah. Did. did that did that cha did that change the mindset? Did that like touch the heart? Like you still got love for the Chargers? Do you you still live in Dago? No. With LA now. Yeah. LA. LA now. Keep following the Chargers. Okay. Right. <laughs> no, but it, uh, <laughs> they offered me like to stay, but it wasn't like. It wasn't the right situation? No. Nah, it they wasn't right. LT. Yeah. No. Uh, he actually left. He was with the Jets then. Jets. Mm. Yeah. But it, but it had. Um, Ryan Matthews? Yep. Ryan Matthews was mm. there. But it. Um, but like, Drew had came with me. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, came to me, called me, was like, hey, um, uh, Reggie about to leave. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like I want you to come. Like, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. 
And then y'all was together training, like you know yeah. what I'm saying. But y'all didn't play together. So, in, in San so this was yeah, we did for one year. So this was during the lockout year, like you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Like mm-hmm. we training, we got drafted. Yeah, right. right. Yeah. We training, whatever. Like he kept on saying, like, hey, like, and when you come to New Orleans, I'm like, man, New Orleans, man, I, don't, I don't know, like you know what I'm saying. Yeah. But then like um uh lockout was lifted, whatever. New Orleans kept calling. I'm like, you know what? I'm like, going to Nola. I'm going to New Orleans. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, so it was between New Orleans and Philly at the time. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So that was when Philly had the dream team. Remember the dream team? They had, they had like, it was uh they had Namdi, they had Awesome. Uh, uh, yeah. I, yeah. Vince Good Young things. was there. I think they had uh they had some more people. But then like I chose New Orleans, like you know what I'm saying? Like that was our rookie year. You rookie said dream year. team, I was like, this ain't it. Cause we was stacked. We was rolling. Bro, we should have won a Super Bowl. Yeah. Should have, could have, would have. Probably whatever. probably always gonna go down in my mind. Like two of the times I thought we were gonna win a Super Bowl. Three times. One of the three times. Eleven. Eleven. That was the 18. first time. Yeah, really? that was that was definitely the first yeah, time. That was the first time. 11, 18. But as a rookie, it's, it's glossed over for me. You're a vet. You understand yeah. the magnitude of what just happened. As a rookie, I'm just like, eh, we go to the playoffs every year. We got Drew Brees. We got Darren Sproles. We got Mark Ingram. We got Marcus Colston. We got Lance Moore. We got Jimmy Graham. Man, we got, that boy. you know, it was a whole lot of, <laughs> whole lot of we got, we got. Like, that was a dream team to me. Yeah, it was crazy. We had some, we were stacked. We were stacked but like, um, uh, you know the lockout, like you know what I'm saying, like you don't get no visit, like you yeah. know what I'm saying, like mm. you just gotta you really sign look, it and then you go to camp. At numbers hope best, yeah, yeah, like yeah. So like this is like my first time coming to New Orleans, you know what I'm saying. So I get never off the plane, never stepped foot in New Orleans, never. Like, but well, you signed before you stepped in, or yeah, you? like I had to, like you know what I'm saying, like I I gotta do the run test, like you know what I'm saying, like yeah. I gotta go play, like you yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying, yeah, yeah, yeah. So then like um um I got off the plane, whatever, they can't pick me up. So I'm driving down airline. I'm like, man, like. Look a little different than Cali. <laughs> it's way different than San Diego. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but then, like, uh, but then, like, when I got there, man, I love that shit. Yeah. And, like, New Orleans, the team, like, y'all. Right. Like. Came in, killed the condition test. We used to do the. 300 yard. 300, 300 yard. 300 yard. Show. Right. Like 50 yard turns. Yep. And Sprozy, bro, was, was out there taking. Huff. <laughs> we talk about it was you, you get like second staggered burst position like skill guys go like what is it like 52 mid linebackers tight ends some d linemen go like 56 the offensive linemen the get like 60 that, yeah I can't doesn't matter you was blowing them out the water yeah it wasn't close <laughs> but it was like though but like the transition though like okay so i came from san diego like my last year in san diego i, I like I was trying, like I was kind of losing like the love for the game, like you know what I'm saying, because mm. of like stress situation, how they was doing me, like yeah. you know what I'm saying, like yeah. they was trying to hold back with my carries and yeah, all that, you trying know to what bring saying? your numbers down, trying to make it work well, for them, not yeah, yeah, yeah. So they trying to get so, you back at a bar, yeah, yeah, like. So I remember having fun, you know what I'm saying. Yeah. Uh, then I got back to New Orleans, whatever. Like Going I got crazy. around like you, Cam. Uh, yeah. Pierre, like you know yeah. what I'm saying, yeah. like right. the people, like that's my love start coming back for the yeah, game. Yeah. And man, we was man, we was, we was rolling, bro. That year was crazy. Like going, you know what I'm saying, going crazy. Bro, you went for two thousand six hundred yards, two thousand six hundred ninety six yards. Don't short him because he two, beat twenty seven hundred. <laughs> I'll give you twenty seven hundred. The man, previous man. NFL season record for all purpose yards was set in two thousand by Derek Mason at two thousand six hundred ninety. Don't get bored with it. Don't get bored with it. All purpose. <laughs> <laughs> and we ain't done with the history stuff. Trust me. It Don't coming. get bored with the greatness. Him. Don't get bored with it. Listen, then you we had three great years in NOLA. Phenomenal years. Then uh, you traded to the team who what was in the running was, for you was in the anyway. Running. Like it was between like, uh, it was between. So you knew you was going to get traded <laughs> or what? <laughs> Do y'all really want to talk about that? Yes, yeah, we want to talk because about we, this. 2013, we beat Philly in the playoffs. Brandon Marshall said the they playoffs. got tea time when yeah. they like to get messy. Let's get messy. Yeah. <laughs> hey, so <laughs> we after the after, like right after we beat Philly in the playoffs, they was like, we need Sprouse. So, so, okay, so 
So I was at, you know, the, um, what is it called? Uh, all the couples go. We, um, you know, all the couples go in off season. Uh, oh, um, the, the, the Christian retreat. Yeah, 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 PAO. PAO, whatever. The Christian retreat for couples. So I'm and... at PAO, you know what I'm saying? Uh, like the last day, whatever. They got popped up on Twitter, like Darren Sproles, Lance Moore, Pierre Thomas or something uh, was up to be traded. Like, you know what I'm saying? So then, uh, for Marty, came to me, was like, bro, was like, yeah. you know about this? I said, hell no, I didn't know about that. With, like, you with, know what I'm with wifey, like, with, yeah, like, you know, you I'm, over, I'm, over, I'm, a, I'm praising the Lord right now. Yeah, I'm, I'm getting praised and worship. We yeah, didn't have like, a great session like, in. Like, <laughs> like, I'm like, hell no, I didn't know about this. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> what's gonna make so I'm getting on the phone, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. man, like. Call an agent. Yeah, like, call an agent, yeah. like, Sean, like, everybody. Sean ain't picking up, whatever. Um, uh. Um, then I called my agent, like my agent was like, yeah, like, um, um, uh, got your name out there. Uh, some teens or whatever been calling for you. Well, I'm like, I'm like, damn, like, um, uh, thought everything was going good. Yeah. Like, I wish you would have called and told me like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. But so then like, uh, so then like, uh, Sean act called me. It was like, yeah, like, yeah, like, um, we going we going to uh, release you. Like, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, cool. Like. Go ahead, like. Then I get to pick where I go. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so, so it was like two days later, like you know what I'm saying? They still didn't release me, like you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so my agent on the phone with the Falcons. Oh, the Saints that found out that you was gonna go there, that I was gonna go to the Falcons. So they was like, "Oh no, like, uh, uh we just gonna, gonna trade, like you know, we ain't what gonna saying? see them twice a year." Yeah, like, uh, <laughs> we just gonna trade, like you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, okay, like you know what I'm saying, like. So the two teams was Philly. It, it was Philly, Minnesota, and it was the Redskins, whatever. Uh, um, uh, so, so I told my agent, like, hey, they trade me to the Redskins, I'm not going. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. yes, sir. That is going to be a jacked up trade because I'm not pull going. Pull Eli Manning. Yeah, it I is what going. it is. Like, yeah. I'm not going. Like, um, uh, so my agent got that out the way, whatever. So he was like, uh, Philly, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, Chip Kelly, like, they want you. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, Come on, let's go. Like, you know what I'm saying? Right. Uh, uh, the offense was high power. Yeah, like, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm like, let's just go. Like, you know what I'm saying? So then we went. Um, but man, I love Philly though, man. Yeah. 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 Uh, like once I got there, like, you know what I'm saying? Like the fans is tough. So I've heard. From me to getting traded though, like, right. like from New Orleans, that shit hurt me. I was hurt. Like, you know what I'm saying? But once I got to Philly. You blood, sweat, and NFL record season. Man, like that, like and just the vibe, like yeah, yeah. The camaraderie like that shit hurt as a though. team. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. like I always thought when you leave a good place, it do hurt though. I, like. I was always gonna be like a saint, like for the rest of it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like rest of my career, like right. That's what I thought. You know what I'm saying? But I mean, you went to Philly yeah. first season there. You selected to the Pro Bowl, second team All Pro, like yeah. Everything happened for a reason, like. Like I had to make, like, like, I wanted the Saints mad at that trade. Like, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> and they was. <laughs> Clearly, you off the but rip, I, you go pro bowl and all pro off the bat. Right. But I was, man, that, that shit hurt me though. Cause then you go you to know, next was, year. I'll say, how's the locker room vibe? Like, how's the locker room vibe in the Chargers versus the locker room vibe at New Orleans where you know it's, it, it was. It's a good time. Like it's. It's a lot of guys that are close. It's a lot of guys. A lot of guys close. And I would say 2011, 2013 was. 2011 was a great locker room. Vibing. 2012 was a great locker room. 13 got a little. A little bit. A little scary. It, you did, you missed good. out on 14. Right. 14. You missed out 14, 15, 16. Whoa. Three years, seven to nine. So the years you left, we. That's you good. was thriving and we was depriving. <laughs> <laughs> Deprivation. Yeah. We were we were fighting for our lives. They tried to kill me. You going Pro Bowl and All Pro, two years in a row. We no no no. <laughs> <laughs> but like the locker rooms, like in San Diego and in New Orleans, kind of different too, though. Like, like in San Diego, like it was more like a fashion show and you like you know what I'm saying yeah, like yeah. I've heard I've a lot heard, of glitz like, and glamour places, like, like you know what I'm saying like, they yeah. cared about just, cars and right. and you can't just roll in you, you know just can't roll in with your little Tahoe yeah you like rinky dink nah but, you know, like, but like when I got to New Orleans 
it wasn't all about that. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like trying to win. Trying to win. They like, just came fresh. We all was close. Bowl, like, like, you know what I'm saying? 2009, like right. the winning culture there. Right. Like, and it wasn't no clicks. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was. Come to, hey, at, if you need me, come get me. Right. What's up? And then um, when I got to Philly, Philly was a, a lot like New, New Orleans. Orleans. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Big family. It was vibe. no click. Right. Yeah. Like, the clicks was like the whole team vibe. Yeah. So, so that was good fans, like good yeah. atmosphere. You with Chris Long, Chris Long, that's my dog. Yeah, that's my dog, Chris Long. You was out there with you was with who got his podcast. What you was with Ryan Matthews there too, huh? Yeah, Ryan DJ. Matthews, DJ, my last year. Oh, Ryan Matthews came back through. Yeah, Ryan Matthews. Uh, was it Ajayi? Uh, uh, no, no, you played. With Jay, Jay was, was there. there. Yeah, Jay was there. Who else? I had. Um, um, you might even caught some Boston Scott. Was Boston? Yeah, there? No. Boston was there. Yeah, yeah Boston, Boston. Yeah, yeah. Jordan Boston. was was not Jordan Howard. Which was, was, was Jordan, Jordan Matthews? Jordan Howard. Yeah, they, yeah Jordan Matthews receiver. Jordan, Jordan Matthews. talking about Jordan Howard, the, the running, running back. Jordan back. Howard, yep, yeah, my yeah, dog. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I was gonna say, I was like, might have been, might have been both Georges. Look, there was you a real one though, bro. Like anybody, you he was there for what six? Like some six. some people, like some OGs, like they don't pass the game down. Like you always gave the game back. Like that's why you respected by every single person that you ever played with. You know what I mean? Like. See, I always was like, like when I was young, like LT, like Lorenzo Neal, they was my OGs, you know what I'm saying? Like, them was the ones that taught me, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, um, uh, we all trying to win together. Like, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, the thing is, is, like, we can't play football forever, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So you always want to pass down some knowledge. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like to your young fella. You, know you did I'm that for me, bro. You did that for me. For real. I appreciate you. I've been told you, but right. you did that for me beyond measure. Like helping me grow as a more complete back, as a more complete player. Like, especially being a young guy who was like kind of frustrated, kind of early in my career, injuries, the role, the situation. Like, you helped me out a lot. You know what I mean? And me going to my 12th year. I've grown a lot as a player, as a runner, because of what you taught me. Like, man, that's uh, that's been my plan. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, as long as I can touch like one or two, like, you know what I'm saying? I'm sure, you touched way more than that, but but I always feel like I done told you, but I got to say it on the pod. You my dog for life, and I'm definitely better from being with you, sitting with you in that meeting room for three years. You know what I mean? Man, I appreciate and having that. you as my blood brother, helping me out. Watching me from afar, from even when you was in Philly and even now, like, I'm in 12, so. 12 same. of them yeah, things. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> My dog Sproze, 15 of them. Man, since you ain't gonna do it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna drop it before, you know what I'm saying? Pull this Mark Ingram real quick. Whole NFL career, 3,552 rushing yards, 23 rushing touchdowns, 553 receptions, 4,840. Receiving yards, 32 touchdowns, 311 punt returns for 2,961 yards. And seven TDs, 332 kick returns for 8,352 <laughs> yards and two TDs. There's nothing you you did not touch in the game. When I tell you all purpose, you are him. When they say like, oh, he can, you know, be a runner. He can, he can be a, a wide receiver. He can be a punt returner. There is nobody who encompasses that idea. Then, you know, they're going to have to start off with tank. Darren Sproze. Yeah. I call him Sprozy. I'm a I'ma have to refer to him as as the legend. I just I haven't been doing you a just just respect. Who's a all pro, all a all pro pro bowl. What what have you not done in your career? Um that brings it to a conclusion. Like you you retire and you go into you go straight into what you got hired as as a as a personal consultant. So it's not like you just stopped with the game. You and he's part, a, and, still a, part of the Eagles. And he's a Super Bowl champ. All pro, Pro Bowl, and Super Bowl champ. Well, I said, what haven't you done? <laughs> Super Bowl winner, you won that. <laughs> won that. My bad, but hey, <laughs> hey, I just don't want these people to get bored with the greatness. And to top the greatness off, you have a Super Bowl champion. Right. But continue. You yeah. said that you said he. Yeah, yeah look. Yeah, look I didn't, I'm sorry. Retired. Retired. I didn't mean to cut you off, blood. Look, then a retire. <laughs> And then still was part of the game was was with the with the Eagles as as a personal consultant. What what I don't even know what capacity that means. Like what is what is that? A personal consultant. They created a title for my dog. <laughs> they don't got them on nowhere else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come, come come do this. Like I'm in 
all the departments, but um, but like I'm in all the departments. Like you trying to figure like, out what you liked. Yeah, like the I'm just trying to figure out what I like. But like for me, the end result, I, I like I want to be a GM. Like you know what I'm saying? Like mm. that's like my that's like my goal. You know okay. What I'm so you're trying to figure out like what what is it I like right now that's gonna get me here? Or trying to learn everything. Yeah. All the ins and outs. I'm trying to learn everything right now. Mm. So learn what it takes to run a successful franchise. Yeah. Learn what it takes like to to scout. Like yeah. learn what it takes like um like with the salary cap. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know how well, they you got to a little bit with of everything. Yeah. yeah, like everything. Jeez. Hey, look, the way you took to the field, you clearly had the vision for it. So I ain't here to knock you. I ain't gonna call you too small for not a nerd not a I ain't gonna say, look, we we know what you can do. I ain't knocking a damn thing when it comes to Sproles. <laughs> Boy, then to beat the odds 10 times over at every level. And when you got someone that's smart and dedicated and driven as you are, I know whatever you want to accomplish, you're going to do it. I know you're going to do it. But with that being said, man, I know man, we do this thing called What Grinds Your Gears, man. Like, we're, 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 what really bothers you? It's a little segment, man. Like, one thing that really grinds my gears is one thing is like, when I'm driving in the fast lane, you know what I mean? On the highway, 75, 80 miles per hour. I'm not speeding like 100, but I'm going 75. Somebody going 50 in front of me, like, move the fuck out the way, bro. Like, move, bro. Like, there's two other lanes. Get out the fast lane. Another one, hotel checkout times. Like, check-ins at 4, checkouts at 11. Like, why is it not the other way around? Like, I come... To your city, I want to enjoy. I land early. I want to enjoy my enjoy, day. Right. I gotta leave my bags at the bell stand and come back at four o'clock. Like it's hot outside. I don't know where to go. I want to go to my room, change. Like I leave and I wake up. You want me out at eleven? Like I want to wake up, have a good breakfast. Like you mm -hmm. know what I mean? Like let me get a little time. Come on, can man. I a, like can I, a, can I get a workout and then that really a does. Kind of, yeah, that really does kind of like. Grind just grind mind. my gears, yeah. like or like you know you work out all day. You hit you you hit like you got practice in the morning. You know, whatever football we football practice go from the time we get in was eight o'clock till five o'clock. Get home five thirty. It been a long ass day. You like Lord Jesus. I just want I just want a cup I, of I juice. I'm just want yeah. a cup of ice and some juice. He can't he and wants you go in there, juice. You go into the fridge, grab your juice, and in that jug of juice, cranberry, grapefruit, apple, whatever. It, it's not enough for a real cup. It's that like little squeeze. It's a, it's a squelch of juice. It's a dab of juice. It's that corner of juice. And you're like, brother, like just you either finish that shit or you throw it away. Don't <laughs> piss me off. Like, I'm not like, I'm not trying to pull rank in the house, who I am to y'all. Like, I love everybody here and everybody deserves this juice. Just leave a sufficient amount but of either juice. Leave <laughs> enough for a cup or kill or it. Don't leave anything. Like, I'm 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 better off you killing it you and kill. like right. all right, next drink. Then damn, I just got a I got a corner of grapefruit juice. Who the who ate who drank daddy's juice? <laughs> and you know who did it. Who? The kid. I'm gonna blame it on the kids. So it's, yeah, you weren't gonna do it to wife. I'm gonna blame the kids. Yeah. So right. You know, yeah. I'm gonna blame it on wife. <laughs> but you know, like you, defense go to dinners, and you like, yo, it's like ten o'clock. I'm not trying to eat like that because you know we got this game coming up. Yeah. So I'm gonna save this for tomorrow. I'm gonna smack this, you know, this this beautiful looking. For me, it's gonna be a rack of lamb yeah. with the with the mac and cheese and the mashed potatoes. You're gonna kill it after the, the fast Friday and the cream spinach. I'm gonna kill this after fast Friday. And fast Friday was, uh, you know, practice supposed to be fast on Friday, so fast Friday. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so you come we back got them flats on. hey you come back you know it's one o'clock in the afternoon you starving you ain't ate nothing since breakfast right come in to the fridge and it's gone whole what? house got burned <laughs> 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 somebody getting this work I ain't asked I ain't asked for nothing oh, I, I would I, I text you whatever you can like but don't don't eat my food I, within I, 24 hours if right. I leave if I, if I leave if it's there Sunday you deserve yeah. to eat that Saturday go but ahead. you know what like my wife, so she like, she um, uh, she does that like. Say we go to like, we always have like to have like, little date night. Date night, you know yeah. what I'm saying? But like, she always bring her food home, whatever. Then it'd be like lunchtime, like the next day, I'd be like, man, like she ain't even touched. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. she ain't even touched. Yeah, 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 yeah. Even thinking about this, you it's know only, what I'm saying? It's only eighteen hours. Man, I. Kill it. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> she ain't go back for dinner. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, thinking it's still there, but it's gone. Give right. at least 24. But it's gone. Like, <laughs> she'd be mad at that, but you know what I'm saying? So but, that's what grinds her gears. <laughs> yeah, it grinds her gears. grinds her gears. But like, for me though, like, 
man, I'm chill, man. I, don't too much bother me, man. But I'm gonna tell you something. This LA traffic <laughs> dr grinds my gears, though. Like you know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> like it'll take you two hours, man, to go, go three miles. Three and a half. I'm miles. like, man, come on, man. Might as well like, get on well, a bike. Yeah, Might like well, man, this is this is stupid. <laughs> Like you gotta really plan your day around that traffic. Around the traffic. Yeah, yeah, like like when we set up the. I asked my dog, could he come on the podcast? Right. He said, "What time? <laughs> yeah, what time?" Like he said, "What time? I gotta get to six, seven. Man, oh no, it's like. So this this thing about here, you can't go too early, and, and you can't be like in the mid of the day. Like mid of the day is bad for dead. you. Dead. Which makes no sense. Stop. I don't understand. Like why at three o'clock? Like why? At, at 11.35. Don't nobody work here, I feel like, either. Yeah. I'm like, man, what's like, like, who, who, Whose it's, jobs is, is right. not working? It's Wednesday at 11.30. Where and is everybody crazy. going? I got done working out today at like 9.30 off, off the sand dunes in, in Manhattan. Man. Man Beach. You know, I had to go get it. Right. Me and my dog, Mar Jones. Either way, I mean, I'm, I'm coming back and it's traffic. And it would take me 30 minutes to get there, 40 minutes tops. It took me an hour 20 to get back. I said, Lord Jesus, fire. Oh, <laughs> I'm just, it's real. Like you know, it's real. It's real. Like, give me an HOV lane at least. Like, give me, give me a capacity to get, you know, get in the. That boo -boo. should be stopped. I'm like, man, stop. Yeah. Stop. Like, Everybody in Tesla <laughs> made no sense. Right. Stop. 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 <laughs> Battery on. Life support. Life is right. <laughs> <laughs> I need a supercharge. You know, you said you, you said you know your ideal goal is to be a, uh, a, a GM. You know that love for the football is still there, but like, how does that transition work? Because you know. The competitiveness of, of an athlete, the, the the nature that we take to our workouts, to the way we put you know food in our body, to the way we provide for our families, to catching a flat, hitting a, a fast draw, uh, coming coming in for you know the the most all purpose yards ever in the history of football, that doesn't translate to being a GM. Like, how does that mindset shift, or how does that change from? retiring, playing football since you were eight years old to 36 to now being in retirement. What is, what is that transition? How does it change you? How do you look at things? Cause you can't get, you can't ever get that exciting feeling back of Friday night lights. You can't get that Sunday night football, Monday night football. Right. Now you behind the scenes. But like, like see, like for me, like, like I get a rush for like helping build a team. You know what I'm saying? Like that's my rush. But like, I really get like my game day feeling, whatever. Like my kids run track, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. so, so like with me, I get more nervous. Watching them. Before they get ready to run. Yeah. Then like what I did, you know what right. I'm saying? When you're playing. Um, playing, like you know what I'm saying? you want them to do really well. That's that's the thing, like, so, so, so like that same feeling like game day, I get that just for being a dad. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, mm. um, watching your kids compete. Compete. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's where I get my rest from. There's, yeah. there's pride in there. There's, yeah, there's legacy like, in there. Yeah. Like, there's the soccer games on Saturday, boy, be in, be out there like, I love Ryan. <laughs> right. Ryan. Right. Oh, so, so you, <laughs> the, you the push. So there's got to be somebody in the family to push, and there's got to be somebody like, I'm on, the, I'm, on, I'm on the other side. I'm like, I'm like, Dad, he did this. Hey, relax. Relax. Hey, it's just it's just a game for kids right now. This holds no weight right now. I just want that, effort. I just yeah. want effort. Hey, but I got I got wifey on the other side. Run! Go ahead. Give him the elbow. Give him the elbow. All right. Give him the See, like, I feel like if I had like a son, yeah. I, I'd be harder. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Now I got daughters. Um, my wife is the one that hard on them. Like, yeah, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Like daddy is daddy. Like yeah. Well, you don't have to do that to them because she, she has, has she's she has yeah, that you gotta, mentality. You gotta, be right. a, you gotta you gotta have a pusher. Yeah. You gotta have like you know. Yeah. Well, you have an alpha wife. You do too because yeah. she was uh, ran track and competed. Your 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 wife played basketball at the highest level. Like my wife was an athlete and competitor too, but she's a little bit more reserved than I am. You know what I mean? Right. So it's like when you have daughters, like you don't have to do that because she's on them on right. them like that. So you could be like they like kind of escape a little right. bit. Like you know what I mean? But my whole thing is. Just give me your best. That's all I want. Your effort. best, then I'm I'm fine. I, I don't I don't care if you're good, if you're not. Like if you just give me your effort. Best, yeah, that's it. Just if give you, me effort. If you come in last, guess who's gonna be right there cheering for you? 
Me. I'm right. your man. As long yeah. as you tried your hardest. Yeah. Right. If I see you half assing and you coming first, I'm still on your head. Like, yeah. what are you doing? Like, we don't we don't do that. If you won if you won by a step, you could win by ten. That, right. That's what I I'm reserved and I'm calm, but if I don't see you giving the effort, like yeah. I'm I'm on you. Violet, run, girl. So you say you had more. Like you so you say you had more. All right. You know what time it is? In my family, we run hills. <laughs> and in Louisiana, we run levees. So they know they know what time it is. Yep, right. We to the levees. Come on. Now nah, you know what time it is. Up. Uh, we was in Florida. You saw him. Hey, you saw him. Hey, I'm sending a video out. My kids out here. Oh, oh, we talking back today. You know what time it is. We going to the, we going to the fields. Well, we're like Tank J, ten push ups, ten jumper jacks. Oh, hey. Yeah. Yeah. All this, all this, you know, whoop kids. I'm like, I'm I, like, I, I got whooped growing up, and I, I don't know. I got think whooped. it. Got beat, bro. Yeah. I'm trying to do this real, on. A, I'm trying to do real. this on. A, real, I'm trying. To, hey, I'm trying to do this on a PC. You know, like, <laughs> and I feel like you know, you get out of line. You know, I, I, I'm, I'm here to help you get back in line. But there's other <laughs> ways. We are gonna make you strong and fast. I got them doing. Hey, we'll be at the house. We'll be at, at a restaurant. I don't care. Hey, ten push-ups. Wife, you'd be like, you're not on the ground. Ten squats. All right, ten jumping jacks. Oh, you still not listening? And we just go up. And if they talk back, we just we start even multiplying and we add on. <laughs> oh, oh that's second. Sits, that's hey, I, yeah. they, they know. Hey, yeah, they know all squats. Sits, yeah. Hey, this is the funniest the thing. Sits. Hey, it's Ooh. the funniest thing ever to see. Hey, to see them yeah, little legs be shaking. shaking. <laughs> I'm like, I'm trying to keep it in. I'm like, right. I'm like, no, you no, got, you yeah. got ten seconds left. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, For real. No, but one thing uh, I do want to touch on before we uh, wrap up is um, just like how you was the OG to me. How you passed the game down to me. How you showed me love. How you. Wasn't selfish. You passed the game on, like you know what I mean. And I do that too, like you know, with AK, like whoever, whoever I'm in the room with. I'm sure you did the same. Like you said, LT was like that for you, like a legend in the game, Hall of Famer, one of the best backs to ever play the game. Like, how was that learning from him, being in the room with him? How'd that help you grow? Like, is y'all relationship still, still tight to this day? Like, what was that yeah. like? Yeah, yeah, like that's my, you know what I'm saying. Like, like you came in as a rookie, and that was that was, was in the room. Yeah. That was my. The, uh, that's my OG, like you yeah, know what I'm saying. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah, that's the um. He showed me how to be a pro. Like he, like he was the uh, first one, like to show me like about the massages and the you know what I'm saying, the cold. Take care of your body. You know what I'm saying. Like he was actually the one that showed me how to watch film. I was in college, man. Yeah, he was out there he, making it happen. Yeah, like yeah. I believe in me. We didn't watch film like that. Like you right. know what I'm saying. Like we made a watch it. Like you know what I'm saying. Like seeing stuff, but like. You weren't, you weren't. He like, he broke it down for me. Like, what yeah. I need to be looking at. What, yeah. what they say, if you see a little, you can see a lot. See, yeah. If you see a lot, not really seeing them, but a little. Right. You watching the flow of the game, but you ain't catching you ain't, how to break off the, the linebacker coming down. You ain't watching, you know, the safety come down disguising and he's phasing back. You watching just, oh, this is what I can do. Right. You watching just the flow of the game. Whereas you you start zoning in like oh they they targeted me because when I do a draw yeah. I take a step back right yeah. oh when I see Self the linebacker when I see the linebacker you know inch in within the five yards of a box I, it's like he's coming downhill versus where he's seven yards out oh he's it must be zone right. versus corners whatever it is yeah. it's you know learning out how to break down with, with like film like like what he like showed me was like sometimes like with the ends with the ends like. Um, uh, like the stand up ones, like sometimes when they gonna rush, whatever, they had the inside leg up. Yeah. And if they gonna drop, they had the outside leg. Yeah. yeah. Outside leg up. I said, I, I said, started damn, switching like, that up just cause. Oh, yeah, did you? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. But yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you think I gotta tell? So it's like, yeah. Self, so it's like self scout too. Self yeah. stuff. Yeah. You taking you taking self scouts and you also take so you like, yep. a little bit of everything else. Yeah. yeah. You got to self scout. You got to self scout. So if you out for if you out for like a flat, you know the whether D E the D N covering you or it's gonna be a backer. Well, yeah. like like how when we stack, like they light on their hands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like how we stack our he alignment. Bang you. How we stack our alignment. I won't. I, I'll stack my alignment and run and run inside zone from the gun. Like I'll stack Ooh, my alignment. Like yeah. so like so like he thinks I'm for releasing. No, I'm coming. Uh. You know what I mean? Yeah. So, like, so coaches hate it, but sometimes they hate it because like, what? Well, look at your alignment. Look at your alignment. But I'm like, that's what I'm playing. It. I'm playing a game within a game. Right. Like he thinks I'm for releasing on the choice or why? No, I'm coming inside zone. Uh. -huh. See, like with me, like when I played, I didn't care. Like, stop it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Mm. Like I run in choice. I'm gonna line up a little, little 
uh, uh, um, like a little closer and wider. Like, you know yeah, what I'm saying? You like, straddles the outside leg. Yeah, probably, like, yeah. stop it. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what's coming. Stop yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Prove to me. Yeah, prove, yeah, <laughs> prove to me. Yeah. Not yeah. a choice. It's a but then, like, but then, like, some They try to bang me with the end. They, yeah, they like, try to butch you. Yeah, yeah with like, the end. Yeah, yeah. Stop it. Yeah. I hate the butch. It's the worst call ever. But the thing is with that, the thing is with that, you did your job. Yeah, they can't. He ain't rushing. He ain't rushing. Yeah, you putting two, three people on me. You ain't rushing. You ain't My get... quarterback got to go somewhere else. Yeah, that yeah. might be a new grind. My gears. <laughs> <laughs> grind my gears is it, I be thinking about stuff like that annoy me now I be like bro I do that I, really just kind of just irritated me like, so that, that was my last my grind my gears about the hotel check I was like three weeks ago <laughs> I'm like we were sitting there I got all the kids right they running around the lobby I'm like y'all need to make all the noise and do all the stomping around in here because they need to let us in a room I'm, like, see, That'd be a situational grind my gears because if it's if it's just me you can kick me out treat me almost how how you want to like. Hey Cam, I know, you, no, no, you, family, yeah, yeah. you know you couldn't get in until five, six o'clock, but we need you out by ten. All right, I'll make it shake. Yeah. Like I'll, I'll be all right. Whatever. I'm sleeping. You but could, you could want family? me to check out eleven like, if yeah. you want. Like well, if I got to hear from wifey, that's really gonna be right. Like, that's I, yeah. It's really, it's really the the wife proponent. Like you, right. like she be like, babe. Like you got to hear her mouth. I'll be like, man, right. let me. Like she get, or she just give you the look. Like I gotta say something now. And Yo, then, check out at eleven. Yeah. Right, <laughs> not mine. <laughs> Hey, you see how many times I'd have been out there in the in the, in the, in the housekeeping right there with the car? Like, all right, you got you got yeah, some time. One thirty, do whatever hey, you got to do. I'm gonna call down. Hey, we need a one. Oh, we don't have hey. one for you. Well, I'll be out at one. So, y'all uh, know what I hated though. Like, like my first time running like gun like inside zone and stuff like that. When I got to Philly, like, um. When I first started learning how to do that, I hated that man. Yeah. Like the gun run. Yeah. Like the gun like inside zone. Mm -hmm. I like to be in the eye mm. where I can see this. Yeah. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that, yeah, yeah. yeah that, that backside. Well, like, kinda, you, you have to square your shoulders. It's hard to. And I'm kinda, so tight. Like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Well, the, the eye puts you right behind the quarterback. Right. So you see the, I can you see see, everything. You see the vision. You put, it, you put yourself in a gun. So you, the quarterback's at depth. You're off depth. So you're they're offset. You're right. So you're only. You, I feel like you still have the same vision. For you, it might be a change. Man, you don't have tight. the same vision, especially because. If you don't square your shoulders, you it's can't see with. this. Yep. You can't mm. see this back here. Because some people will come through on the mesh and their shoulders will be tilted. And you'll never be able to see the backside mm -hmm. cut. When you say mesh. The mesh is the, the handoff mm -hmm. and... and the, yeah, the tack point for what I call the mesh is the, the tack point, what you're saying. Yes. But sometimes the mesh can be either hip or it can be actual handoff. So Yeah. The mesh point. So, mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah. Gotcha. That's decent to talk. You're talking about Facts. Yeah. I mean, right. we, yeah. you were still saying mesh and it's... Right. You're, you're giving you have to have a one. clean mesh all the time yep. right the handoff the handoff the handoff point, yep. whatever but like once you learn to sh slow down and square your shoulders you can see that you can see that you can see it right mm. but it takes a while but I like running out of the gun because I'm always in a heavy set formation you're giving a switch up this yeah, is switch, right. change up so they think I'm I'm doing a pass or I'm in nickel personnel so I just love it you know what I mean because <laughs> I'm always a head buster yeah, but you know, but I mean? like with me, see, I'm see, I'm one eighty, like one eighty five. Like you know what I'm saying? I like to hit it full speed, so I can break arm tackle. Like you know what I'm saying? But right. you have good if I'm beat. not up to speed, like to hit it, like they can just grab me. Yeah, yeah, me too. But so you, you like the 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 gun puts you in that slow to that carry. slow, and you yeah. trying to when it, he, yeah. Then when it went open, I can just hit it. I don't right. mind the inside zone ones, but it's the outside zone ones that you have to cut up because you really have to really slow. No, I love them though. Yeah, out of gun, that'd be yeah. like a pump return to me. Yeah. Like I, I take that step stretch it, I, stretch it, yeah, and then yeah. when they when I see that flow, I'm, I'm going down here. Yeah, and I'm gonna go ahead and lead this already. Like I'm, I'm just gonna lead this because y'all y'all start talking about that running back talking. You know? I'm carrying, but I'm gonna say, you know, whatever. But you got hashtag good vision. Say, hashtag say the running back, by the way. But you got good vision and good feet, so the inside zone, fine with it. Yeah, I've yeah. seen you hit. I've That's seen what I'm saying. We, we like we we talk. I'm I'm talking one on one. Y'all on three o three. Um, advanced placement courses. Yeah, you, you <laughs> talking you talking some real running back. That's what I'm saying. Y'all y'all got too excited. The one that really like taught me how to run that though was um it was it was a uh, Shady McCoy. Yeah, he Shady. So he was like he like bro, man, like man, just slow down, just slow down. And treat it like a damn draw. Yeah. Make sure your shoulders are square though. You but this, have, but this gotta have square shoulders. Yeah. But like, but he was like, treat it like a draw. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The bitch can hit anywhere. It can. Just, just hit it. I said, you know what? You right. You right. <laughs> you right. You was right. You hey, was mother. Shady ran for eleven thousand yards. Eleven thousand. Yeah. Jeez. Yeah. 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 This is real running back stuff.
But yeah, man, um, what an honor we had today to have the legend himself, Darren Tank Sprozy, hmm. in here on the Trust Levels podcast season three. He said he, I, I was going to have to see him if he didn't get on the pod, but we just had to make sure we had the best situation, the best set, the best experience for the best of the best to come on to the pod. You feel me? We talking about an NFL record holder, a college record holder, a high school record holder. Like I told you guys, don't be bored with the greatness. Respect the greatness because it is exactly what I said it is. Greatness in the flesh, on the podcast, on the biggest of the trust levels in that season three. Uh, NFL records, franchise records with the Chargers, franchise records with the Eagles, franchise record with the Saints. This man has been setting records on records on records. All purpose. All purpose. Don't do, they don't put him in a box now. Ain't no box because he didn't defy. blew the box out. <laughs> defy defy he didn't naysayers, the box naysayers and daysayers. Since they day said one. they he was not gonna do this. They said he wasn't they. gonna do that. They still saying this and they saying Who that. Is they? But it don't matter. It's just a little rat a tat tat to a player. He's a giant in the world. It's my dog, my big brother, my OG, Darren Sproze. We got my co-host, Cam J, the legend himself. Feel like we in a cypher. Right. <laughs> Bars. Bars. Man, you know what we doing. We, we, we ain't new to it. We true to it. You know what I mean? that's on the biggest. Mm. And that's on the biggest of the trust of the levels. It's on the hoodie. And that's all goody. Mm. Make sure you go get that. Bars. You know what I mean? Mm. Make sure you go get that. They look like they're the same, but they different. Mm. You know what I mean? The detail. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We like that. Got my brother Cam J all decade in his own right. All decade. All decade Ooh. in his own right. I'm sitting next to a gold jacket worthy candidate. He's going to be a gold jacket worthy candidate. And like I said, I'm my brother's keeper. Active. You know what I mean? And I'm still Active. stacking and we still pushing. Active. You know what I mean? We still leveling up. Yes, sir. And we still Levels. leveling up. <laughs> and that's on the trust level season three. Sprozy, Cam J, Marky e. V. Let's get it.